Hello, hello, everyone. Yes, this is the energy. Hi. Woo. Have you guys had a great time at Worldcon so far? Incredible scenes. So I am about to introduce your GM for this incredible campaign. They are not only one part of, <laughs> my apologies, introducing is not my job. How did you know? Um, they are one of the founding members of the Black Dice Society. They are the founder of I Need Diverse Games. And you may know them from a tiny little show called Rivals of Waterdeep. <laughs> Introducing to the stage, Tanya DePass. Hello, hello, everybody. Oh, am I live? I don't know, can you hear me? Oh, good. All right, so I'm going to introduce our table, and then we're going to get started. Apologies for the slight delay. Um, starting to my left, the one and only Russell Smith, who joined us, who has been around the con, who's helping with gaming, and has helped keep me sane in the time we've been waiting to start this game. Russell, come on out. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, you know our next player as the voice of Carlac, but also as Thomasina Bateman in Hobbs Barrow. Welcome the one and only Samantha Bayart. Uh, next up, we have, we have not one, but two of the three black halflings. Um, <laughs> Uh, sitting next to me is Jeremy, who you've also seen around the con already. We're going to be doing more stuff over the rest of the weekend. Please welcome Jeremy Cobb. <laughs> and last at the lineup, but never ever least, the amazing Liv Kennedy, who has been just amazing. Also part of the Black Halflings, I'm sure you've seen them around. Again, you're going to be tired of seeing the rest of us by the time this weekend is over. Liv, come out. <laughs> All right, have a seat. Let's go to hell. All right. <laughs> Thank you for the introduction. You're welcome. I'll see you there. <laughs> All right. So, yeah. very quickly, this uh, we're going to be a little mature in our language. I know that this is also going out to YouTube. Hi to my friends on Twitch. Thank you, Worldcon, for getting this together and getting us on stage. So we are, it is a mature game, it's a little adult, so if there's any small humans, just cover their ears, there may be swearing, especially once I put players through their paces. Um, and again, I'm going to ask for you to be a little bit polite to turn off your devices, or at least turn the sound off. If I hear anyone ringing, I might throw a d20 at you. I can't <laughs> see you, but I might still throw one. Um, also, I know some of you like to do this at home. Do not yell out things from the audience. Do not tell us how to play the game. We're all professionals. We know what we're doing. And if we're not being professional enough for you, oh, well, sorry. Because <laughs> we're on stage and you're not. We're going to give you a very entertaining <laughs> evening. Uh, we are planning to play for three hours. So we will take a slight intermission. There are loos to the left of the stage and I believe outside. So when we get about the halfway point, we will raise the house lights. We'll all take a little break, just like if we were at home. And then, you know, just come back in as quietly as you can if you are not back by the time we finish the break. All right, who's ready for some D&D? <laughs> <laughs> I am. <laughs> all right. Our group is a bunch of seasoned adventurers. You've all known each other for several years. You've campaigned together. You've run amok. You've, you've done everything you could do. You're all high level. You're all very experienced. And you know, there's that one last job that everybody says, one more and then I'm out, but then they pull me back in. So you're in this small village. A lot of you have been called forth, allured by promise of enough money to let you retire for really real this time. You know, there, that's a lot of gold. And you know, you're there, you're ready to go steal from a very rich patron. That's what you think you're doing. <laughs> And you have broken in to a manor house. So as you all are kind of getting ready to sneak in and make the score of a lifetime, what do you all look like? What are you playing? Whoever wants to go first. 
Can we roll initiative yes, roll to see who goes first? <laughs> Did you say initiative? <laughs> oh, yeah. The thumbs oh. come out. Yes! Oh! <laughs> yes! Oh well, then we God. have to, surely. Like I mean, if y'all want to fight this early in the game, I'm yeah, not going to sure. stop yeah, you. On it, on it, on it. Roll initiative. Here okay. we go. Can I add my modifier? What? <laughs> my plus 10. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> um, I've got plus 15 because of my nonsense rogue stuff, is that? that so <laughs> yeah, I'm adding uh, mine. So, <laughs> so if, this, if they all kill each other in the beginning, it will be a very short game. I mean, we're just rolling to, to talk about ourselves. Yeah. <laughs> Are uh, you sure? We roll for everything. 21 for me, please. 16 okay. uh, Oh, a natural yeah. 20. Oh, all right. Oh, okay, cool. There you go, cool. a round of applause for the dice rolling. Yeah, these dice are <laughs> safe. Sorry, I'm trying to do simple math. Um, uh, 19 this is why me. I didn't drink before the show. <laughs> 32? <laughs> I'm sorry, what? You're on. Well, I mean, a nat 20 is going to supersede it. that. You've got to honor it. Go. So it'll be, uh, Russ, who is your character? What are you doing? And what do you look like? Ah, well, I mean, you've all heard of me. I'm, I'm Gemini Star. I, I, have probably toured in your, I have probably toured in your town. I, I, may, I may even have your town's name on the back of my jacket somewhere. <laughs> However. <laughs> uh, yeah. Bas uh, basically what ha um, basically probably look a bit like Prince if he'd taken super so assault a super soldier serum. Nice. Um, <laughs> right. oh, no. That's you know, I, I've got I've it. Got it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yes, and um, you've, uh, nobody has ever ever seen me with dirty clothes. Mm. Yeah, I took that. Wrapped up All right. I love it. Uh, so, will I go next? Or will I go sure. Next? Shit. Um, so, I, I joined this group because I'm uh, such a big fan of uh, two of the other members of the group, and uh, the other one's kind of fun to work with. Um, because I'm also a bard uh, and a rogue, that'll come up later. Um, I'm 12 levels of rogue and 8 levels of bard. Uh, my name's Iggy, uh, short for Igneous. Uh, I am a fire ganassi uh, who. Uh, tends to work in hot areas because then she can blend into the igneous rock. Um, and uh, yeah, she's, uh, she's uh, a good combination of like, she's like goth, but like, you know, with flair. So that's her <laughs> barn rogue that's, that's coming out. Yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah. Uh, agreed. Is it me? Yeah. Um, so I'm playing Thorn, who is a male drow rogue. <laughs> um, He's a little forgetful, but like me today. Um, if you were to ask him what he did for a living, he would say he was a locksmith and a purveyor of fine goods, but he is a thief and a fence. And he does these little things at the weekends just to keep his hand in, you know, kind of thing. Um, if it's daylight, he's kind of wearing these. And uh, if you were to look into his eyes and you can finally see the age around his eyes, his eyes are like rubies and they will be very, very tempting for you. <laughs> he also has the most amazing manicured hands. Hands that have never seen a day's honest work in their lives. Um, he's, he's made friendship with this ragtag bunch. <laughs> Maybe a bit of a thieves bargain. Maybe. Yeah, Maybe. but uh, yeah, the one last job, guys. I'm in. <laughs> I'm in. And bringing up the rear with my mere 19 on initiative. <laughs> Standing all of two foot three. Long braided hair that is longer than I am tall. Wrapped around my crotch like a belt. Uh, two, two straps. No one's sure if they're attached to anything, but they stay on anyway. <laughs> Golden skin glistening in the moonlight uh, with my uh, bodily secretions. Big froggy eyes peering out at everyone is Oingo Boingo the Grung. Uh, <laughs> He is a path of the ancestral warrior barbarian, which means he, he is here to support instead of going into a rage. He gets toxically positive. Uh, he, he's very excited. He's just here. Look, he's, he makes a living by selling his own uh, toxic secretions as hallucinogens uh, to help people really get in touch with themselves. Yeah, we've uh, been talking about it. Yeah. Yeah. I, look, well, I'm not telling you. This plus some good therapy. It'll set you right. Uh, and so I am here, uh, just excited to be here, frankly. I don't have a weapon, I just have my froggy hands and gloves. Aww. <laughs> if you like that introduction, Jeremy's our resident, resident GM, and you can tell. <laughs> so, uh... <laughs> All right, so this ragtag group of high-level adventurers, you're, you're seeking around this manor house, 
And the instructions you got said to get through the manor house and get out to the planes that are behind the house. So getting through the house shouldn't be the hard part. Um, do you all want to check anything out, do anything as you're trying to go through this manor house? It's nighttime, yeah? Roll for it. Is it nighttime? <laughs> Is it night time? Yes. Oh, what? <laughs> it is. I can take these off. Thank you. Oh, <laughs> Disadvantage in sunlight. Um, oh, cool. That was it. I'm going to like check for some little alarm systems or something. Yeah. All right. Give me investigation. Okay. Can I give the, the uh, help? Yeah, help action for sure. Oh, yeah. You can give it. Oh, yeah. It, okay. It's a 20. <laughs> oh! No, never mind. It's an yeah, extra no, 20. No, no, nice. I didn't want to help. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> all it's right. All downhill. It's all downhill from here, guys. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I know you all said keep your eyes on the target, but I told you the one reason I'm here is because this per uh, uh, th this house yeah. has the one, the one loot that I have never played, and I uh, and I want it. And oh, the person who has it -O -O has never yeah. played it. It's just, just kept in a. Yeah. Uh, it's just being kept in a cupboard. That, they it's not rude not to steal it. It's a Price Vincent Bone Chiller Strad Edition. There is one. <laughs> so you, one you don't even want to steal the loot. You just want to play it? Yeah. So respect, respect. I mean, I we, we, we could also just take it and play it. That's kind of my Can thing. we just, like, take it off the premises? Oh, I don't and mind which it. way we do this. Okay. All right, all right. We get to play it. Okay. Awesome. So you find, that roll. <laughs> you find every trap between here and the exit. Awesome. <laughs> and because you are such an amazing rogue, those traps are child's play for you. Mm -hmm. You just, you dance around them like, ha ha, fools. <laughs> you thought this would keep me out. And because of that great investigation role, you spot the loot. Ooh. Ooh. Wow, it's an honor to watch a corpse. Look at them go. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Look at it. It's just... Why would, why would you cage up such a thing of beauty like that? Hmm. Yeah. Let it just it's free. yours, friend. Take it. I'm going. And thank you for clearing the way. Anytime. I'd like to sing very softly to like highlight the moment as he's walking. <laughs> <Yeah. around. laughs> oh. Oh. You guys got to be quiet as well, yeah? All right, yeah. yeah. <laughs> my first, see, I remember you from my first ever gig. You were the only person who turned up, and you've been my best, and I've been my biggest fan <laughs> the whole time. Love here you. Here we are. Oh. I'm here to Getting support. A bit you. Emotional here. I'm here to support. <laughs> Eyes filling with tears. <laughs> so, uh, Gemini, you, you take this loot. I need a moment. Please play it. Very carefully tune it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not even in tune. Take your time. It's criminal. Why would it be in tune? It's been in a mm. it's been in a cupboard. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Strum. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's glorious. Oh, oh, oh right. God. Oh, oh, it's oh my God. It was worth oh. the wait. Oh, wow. So you, you strum the loot. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, I don't know if you noticed, but I just did a dice roll. Yeah, I saw that. I was worried. And I got an 18. Something heard you. Yeah. Oh no. You we hear did. a creaking. That's no. <laughs> something else. That's not how that works. Uh, something has heard you strumming this loot. You look up and see two beady eyes staring at you. Is it close to midnight? No. There's no gremlins here. But no, something no, no, evil no. is lurking in the dark. That's what, right <laughs> under the moonlight. I heard a sound that almost stopped my heart. Oh, my God. <laughs> okay, I'm going to start to freeze. <laughs> do, you do, do you speak? Do you do anything else? Well, now that I've got, uh, got my tuning, I'm going to play. Because I've got an audience. <laughs> I don't know who that is. Roll me a performance check. <laughs> If you can fail I, this, I'm going to laugh. Can I back you up? Can I give the help, the help action and just be like... <laughs> <laughs> what you got? Okay, so that is our 12 on the dice, and a plus 17, that is 29. I think he's done it. Well, that backfired for me. <laughs> <laughs> you said make level 20 characters, and people are like, yeah, well, don't oh, mind I know. Shoot, I why, but sure. It's just hilarious. <laughs> Three characters have expertise. <laughs> True. Well, you have a very appreciative little demon just watching yeah. you strum. Oh, that's nice. Do we see this? Yeah, do we yeah. know about the demon? Okay. Oh, okay. It's just this little demon hanging out. It was going to try to bite you, but you are just so good at this. 
No, no. I'm going to go, I'm look at the demon in the eyes of him. Shh. <laughs> oh, it's wrapped. It is just like. That's fine. Just check in. Uh, let me say I run his merch, so I offer the demon a t-shirt. <laughs> Are there t-shirts in favor? Uh, well, like a tunic, maybe. Mm. So you, you have a branded tunic. You have a br Where did you get the branded tunic? Oh, it's in my uh, in my pack here. I wear. You are two foot nothing. <laughs> <laughs> it's a size it's a small. One. It's a size <laughs> extra small. It's a bag of holding, isn't it? Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, I guess so. <laughs> I don't know why you think this demon has actual mortal money, but okay. Oh no, I'll just give the first ones for free. We're well, just thinking like an infernal pact, maybe could it also work? Yeah. You only got time to be making packs. I, I, I can drop a level. We can make a pack. <laughs> <laughs> not right on stage, you're not. <laughs> All right, so you have a new fan. You, great. Um, you, are you going to just keep playing or are you just going to play and walk? Are you going to sork in it? Sure. Um, should we do something about that little guy or should we just kind of let it Yeah, I'm, I'm, a, I'm about to. I'm oh, cool. yeah, okay, fine. Cool, cool. Oh, cool. Great. <laughs> Anyway, wait, what were we doing? What? I can keep playing, it's fine. Okay. I think, we, did we come here for the loot? No, 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 no. You can do something else. Oh, oh yes. Okay, we are good. But I'm if not there sorry is something else, unless there is something else you need, I'll go home after the gig. No, you need to help us do the rest of the job. Yeah. Oh, yeah, fair enough. Do you remember? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Also, can I have a go, like, eventually, like, later on? I just, like, look at the. That's fine, keep time. Yep. Come on, you've done this before. What oh, session? okay. Uh, All right, so now you have a, a, a happy little fan. Just You have a demon just following you now. You guys. You've gained a pet. security. Yeah, security. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It, it wants to keep hearing you play because you got such a ridiculous role. It's just like, you're my friend. I'm never leaving your side. Oh, all right. And uh, you Someone all. Someone name it. <laughs> mm, then he has. Uh, Glenn. I can say Glenn. 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 Glenn, Glenn, Glenn the demon. Glenn, Glenn yeah. the demon. All right, Glenn the demon. Um, Welcome to the group, Glenn. Sure. Uh, growing every day. <laughs> Glenn. We've been paying. Glenn, now that we're friends, is there any sort of shiny, shiny things we should know about in the house? Also, why house. were you yeah. watching us? <laughs> Where did you come from? Is anyone else curious? No, I want to know where the stuff is and okay. we can go home. <laughs> sure. I'm just going to quieten my play a bit so you can have a little quieter conversation. So, so Glenn actually, <laughs> like, as they're kind of paying attention, they heard you and they just point out the back door toward the field that you were going to. This way? Yeah, all right. All right, so we've scoped the room for traps, so yep. we can walk you, through it. You, yeah. You've cleared the traps, you've got your loot, you've now got a little demon friend. I hope you enjoy them. Yeah, thank, thank um, you. Yeah. So you, you get out the back door, and it's just a big meadow. At first, you don't see anything. It's a glen. A glen. <laughs> <laughs> Look. Nice. Now it all makes sense. Now we what you did there. Yeah. Now Disadvantage on all your rolls for that time. <laughs> Uh, uh. Not yeah. actually. Um, <laughs> I'll do it. So you all see this, and you know, as you as you walk a little bit out, you finally see the entrance of a den, and it's it's big enough for all of you to go in. And you you enter. Do any of you check for anything, or you just kind of walk in and see? No, what's I'm going to check there? the traps. That's not what we do. I'm, <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm busy. <laughs> All right, uh, give me another investigation. Yeah, I mean, if you need it, you can have some inspiration because, you know. Uh, Always. I'm giving, I'm giving Glenn a rundown of his uh, discussion. 23. Nice. All right, you, you don't notice any traps. You all do notice it's kind of warm, though. It was a balmy spring day outside. Yeah, strange. You've come into this cave, this, this burrow, and it is warm. Oh, it is very warm. Build like, home sauna. Yeah. Amazing. I'm a fire nasty, so I'm like, oh, balmy. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right, it's nice in here. Yeah, with your old, there's no traps. There's nothing obvious. Oh. You keep going. Until you hear a roar. Oh. Glenn? <laughs> no. Glenn, if Glenn right. made that kind of noise, you should all be terrified. <laughs> <laughs> um, instead, of, instead of, you know, what you're expecting, which is like treasure chests, what mm -hmm. have you, this thing, all the stuff that this guy has squirreled away, off sight of the manor, you find a bronze dragon. Oh! So I'm going to gently back out of the room. <laughs> no, 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 that's what's not going to roll for it. <laughs> You're going to let me back out of the room. You can try. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to do it. <laughs> um, that's an 11 with no modifiers. <laughs> so you trip. Oh! oh. oh. 
Um, but you okay? all. No, you know, actually, none of us are okay. That's a dragon. Okay. Cool. Yeah, I mean, you all may be level 20, but this is a very large bronze dragon. So I just want to get out and run. <laughs> and unfortunately for you, the dragon does not like visitors. Oh, no. Yes. But we've got a world class we musician with us. He's, he's yeah, should he hear apologize play. not for a free show. I have another t shirt. I don't think it's your size. I take I take my medieval t-shirt cannon and <laughs> nice, yes, uh, a little you? extra small. Hopefully he lens. doesn't see it as an aggressive yeah. action. It's, it's made with gunpowder though, so it's like a <laughs> <laughs> loud boom. I did not know you had one of those. Yeah, yeah. So especially for the last concert. <laughs> I'd have put it to use then. So the poor the dragon is like there's invaders in my home and they just hit me in the nose with a thing. <laughs> I hate to tell you all this, but you all are incinerated. Oh no. Uh, Not like to ash, because then it would kind of kill the whole point of the game. But you all are dead. Okay. I mean, uh, I have evasion, so I... <laughs> <laughs> you cannot evade 20 feet of flame in a small space. I don't need to evade anything, but I'm turning my back and I'm floor and dropping to the ground. I don't care, but this guitar, this, this, this lute has got to survive. <laughs> it's your last action on this planet. That is the last yeah. thing I do. We'll discuss that I'd like later. <laughs> I'd like to throw my body over Glenn. Like, oh. <laughs> Glenn's a demon. They're cool. They're just going to go back to him. <laughs> Glenn, no. Oh, I also have you resistance. were nice enough to join us. I have resistance to fire damage. I'm fine, Tanya. I don't know what you're doing. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you're not fine. There's <laughs> resistance, not in you. Yeah. I know. Yeah, it's fair. I know. So. <sighs> I just look like one of those dried out frogs. Oh, yeah. No. Oh, God. Why? <laughs> you're just being more horrifying than I am. <laughs> but, you know, that last job really was the last job. Uh. <laughs> and, but that's, that's the weird thing. You know, a little time passes, and you all open your eyes on a plateau. It's red rock, red sand, it's very warm. And you feel whole and alive. Hmm. I've played here before. <laughs> Hang on a minute. Just there's, sort of, there's, a, there's a trap door or something in the sauna. That's how we got out. We've just gone deeper into the sauna, surely. Yeah. No, no, no. Yeah. I distinctly yeah. remember playing here one time. Okay. Mm. How was the reception? Yeah. I, yeah, was it a good crowd? Fierce. <laughs> cool. Okay. Where's Glenn? Can I roll a perception check? To <laughs> you know what? Go ahead. <laughs> uh, that's a an eighteen. Okay. Glenn is nowhere to be found. <gasps> oh, no! No! There was nothing you could have done. There was nothing you could have done. It's not your fault. It's not your fault. He was so young. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right. Might have gone to get help. Yeah. Surely he's our friend now, right? And as you all are saying this, you hear a woman's voice go, oh, there's no helping any of you. Glenn? I, with my 18, do I know? Yeah, Glenn. Okay, Glenn, sure, you no. found us. I get it, you found us. Come out, let's have a chat. Maybe we could do a little deal or something. Um, you know, maybe we could just come to some sort of understanding here. We're, very uh, we're actually quite important people. Yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, I'm Hang sure on, there's you been know a horrible this, misunderstanding. You yes, know this I'm sure there's been a horrible misunderstanding. Do any of you look for the voice? All you know is it's. I'm talking apparent. into the air. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I'm just looking around. Yeah, whatever. yeah, yeah, whatever's there. And I just make the assumption that you know who everybody is. Sure. To. <laughs> <laughs> so you hear the clank of plate armor. Oh. Sorry, guys, we've done this before. We'll be fine. I guess I'll look. look. Yeah, I'd love I, I to like look. The I'd love to yeah. look. Yeah. So are you, are, are you just kind of trying to perceive, or are you uh, just looking to where you hear the voice from? Yeah, I, I'm if, slowly spinning in a circle to get like a full 360 vantage like, point um, on everything. You okay. see a dark-skinned woman walking towards you, clearly in paladin armor. She's got locks that are pulled back in a braid. Um, you know, big fuck-off sword on her back. Okay. A shield Hi. as well. Okay. I'm just going to ready my weapons. Yeah. <laughs> she she right does not pull her weapons yet. Okay. Hold, hold, the, hold those weapons. Um, hi. Hello. You all just got here, huh? Yeah, you were saying something. Yeah, you talked about, you know, someone's gone for help, I believe. Well, I don't know. I haven't seen him for a while, but I was yeah, trying... Glenn. Oh. Glenn. Who, who's Glenn? <laughs> Glenn's a devil friend that we made. Our Big best friend in the whole devil. world. Devil. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And you just kind of see her, like, not so... 
subtly show you the, the signet of tear on her oh. shield. Oh. Far too small for a devil. What? Glenn. Yeah, I mean, sometimes within a fan community, there are certain groups of people that don't necessarily like each other. But we all, we're all big fans of him, ultimately. And who are you? Wait, what? <laughs> well, we're friends with Glenn. I mean, Glenn invited us over, and before we knew, we found ourselves in a sauna, and there was a dragon, and then we fell through a trap door, and now we're here. We just want to go home. Where are oh, we? Oh, you think you're in a dream. No, I think there's a full, there's a secret trap door with maybe some gold. <laughs> yeah. There's we'll just take the gold and be gone. Yeah. So. And this paladin looks at all of you and then she just starts laughing. Where are we? <laughs> yeah, it's a very good joke, yeah. <laughs> um, have, you heard, have you heard of a place called Avernus? That's it, I knew it. <laughs> Do tell, old boy. It was about five back. Um, yeah, you know, the, you know the Grand Tour? It was the Raising Hells Tour. That's the one, yeah. 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 Amazing. I mean, so? we got bottled off stage pretty quick, but... <laughs> okay, well, hopefully he's improved now. No, no, no. Best gig of my life. Oh, we amazing. got bottled anyway. Great. Were you there, perhaps? <laughs> Clearly oh, not. I would have known who I was. <laughs> You're cute. Maybe a humbling experience could be, you know, pretty. Uh, yeah. I, I don't do too. humble. No, no, this I might be time to just try it. I'm just your understudy, just so I. <laughs> oh, I, it's it's very clear you know nothing about humility. Oh, I do. There was that first gig, but let's not go into that now. <laughs> as entertaining as you all are, I'm guessing you didn't expect to wind up here. But where no. is here? Sorry, I'm Hell. not familiar with Avernus. Very the, funny. The, <laughs> the after, the, the terrible place that people go that are not great people. Okay, but oh, don't you what? have to be dead to be here? Yes. Negative. We're good people. Yeah. We? What are we? So are you saying we're dead? Yeah. I did it. Oh, I feel great. Wait, you, you what? Last gig. I feel good. You did this. <gasps> this is life goal. Anyway. What? Death goal? Because we're mine. dead. What, what, what is this? What is it? How else is, how else are you supposed to go out? <laughs> don't well, want me I never old. really thought about it myself. I wasn't planning to go. I don't want to be old and shriveled or anything. I was just like, you know. Yeah. Well, I can Maybe tell you so. probably. How did you all get here? Like, what's the last thing you remember? Dragon. 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 Oh, that's Dragon. how you got Dragon here. Dragon in the face. Yeah. yeah. So I can guarantee you, whatever's left of your mortal shell probably is shriveled. Sorry. Well, I mean, but look. you've done it before. You've left before. Wait a minute. How's the loot? The what? The Price Vincent Bone Chiller. That's what I went for. And she just pulls it out from behind her back. <gasps> oh, there we are. Give me this. I would love to take a little look at that. Oh, I didn't no. get a chance to. I don't know it. who any of you are. All right. You just right. showed My up. My name's Oingo Boingo. Uh, <laughs> I'll just walk up and say, I realize we haven't introduced ourselves. Uh, hi, nice to meet you. Uh, we just got here. I know. Yeah. Um, what's your name? Celise. Oh, nice to meet you, Celise. Beautiful name. You've got, yeah. Mm -hmm. Really cool. I don't. You also look. Great. Could you let us know how to get back? Well, that's kind of why I showed up. Oh, okay. Because you all, even though not all of you are great people, some of you could learn a few lessons in humility, you're, it's not yet your time to be in Avernus. I agree. So I've got a deal for you, mm -hmm. since you like making deals, my Absolutely. trial friend. I need you to eliminate something that's been a thorn in my side for quite some time. See, I, I'm quite dead. I've adventured well before all of you are around, but I get to do fun stuff like this and maybe send you to your peril because I'm no longer a good paladin. Oh. Yes. Well, it's funny you say, my name is actually Thorn. We do know that, so yeah. that's a bit creepy. It's all coming together. Sure. Serendipity. Right. No, Thorn. I think we could, we could have a deal. Out. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, wait, no. Did you do some summoning by accident or something? I may have done a role very badly earlier. So, All right. yes. so did, um, did you call for a broken oath paladin? Because I knew when y'all showed up. So. Nice to meet new people. You know, you get out. You, you yeah. often can be quite isolated in this sort of work. It was all good. Wait, all right. how tight is our grip on that, that loot? Oh, it's pretty tight. Oh, okay. okay. I won't try. <laughs> well, you're going to try to steal Slight it. Slight of hand, yeah. You know what? Let, let's see what happens. I, I think it's going to be bad. Go, no, go I for it. Do it. <laughs> you don't have to, but I'm curious no, I'm, I'm now. So I would curious. like to see it. I would like to see it. Oh, that's bad, but um, we have uh, we have a plus 17 to that, so it's... Um, and you can't get below a 10. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, you can't yeah, get below a 27. 27. 
27. Oh, is it a 27 automatically? Automatically, yeah, unless you've been hiding it. 27. <laughs> yeah. Probably not enough. I would say, you know, even for a, a level 20 broken of <laughs> undead paladin, 27 is going to get that loot back. Oh, sweet. <laughs> and, you know, she just kind of blinks like, ah, you're, you're good. You remind me of someone I used to travel with. <laughs> so, you know, while I'm sure that you all would like to just go poof and go back to your mortal lives, it's not quite that simple. No? Oh. No. So I've got, a, I've got a thorn in my side. Not you. You're okay, lovely. Fine, um, there's a creature I would like you all to take out. And if you do defeat the creature, once you get past it, there's a portal that will take you back to the mortal realm as you were before you died. What, what, what kind of creature is it? Because we just got incinerated by a dragon. Like, oh, yeah. Yeah. It's, it's, it's not a dragon. It's, it's not a dragon. It's not a dragon. Right. What kind of oh, right. so we're not writing the revenge monster tour. are we going up against? Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> a goose. It's terrifying. It's a rather large goose. This is just a scale. That's all I could carry <laughs> in my pocket. Are you sure we can't go after the dragon? I don't know, man. Okay, so okay, I'm not okay. sure about that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's just a little infernal goose. So then why don't you do it, my love? If it oh, no, I have restrictions. Oh, mm -hmm. tell me Such more. as? Yeah. What? I'm not telling you all my weaknesses. It I'm would, not it you. It would be really helpful to, to, to help you. Well, I can tell you about the goose, just not me. Sure. How many times has that goose bounced you down the stairs? <laughs> I'm sorry, what? I said, how many times has that goose bounced you down the stairs? <laughs> I've lost count. Mm-hmm. That's what I thought. But here's the fun part. You all can get my favor, and should you wind it back in Avernus at your appropriate time, I can be here to make sure that devils, demons, assorted things don't all kill you on sight. Because your undeath can also be really bad as your actual death. It could be really bad. Mm. I, mean, I don't know about you guys, but it sounds like a great deal. I'm yeah. keeping that. I like those lyrics. <laughs> <laughs> I want 10%. I'll haunt you. That's fine. She's good. So, so where is this goose? It is in Fort Knucklebone. Okay. Of course it is, yeah. And where's that? Oh, you need to take a bit of a journey, but I'm going to explain how to get there. Okay. Right. And so Celise points over That's the ridge, um, and you can see off in the distance a, what looks like a town. Accompanying it, background music. Please stop that. I need to concentrate. Um, and so she points, she's like, go there. Look for a place called Mad Maggie's. And when you find Mad Maggie, tell her I sent you, and she will lend you a vehicle because it's far too long to walk. The longer you're here, the longer it's going to take, and harder it'll be to resume your body. So, go to Mad Maggie, tell her I sent you, and that you're on a mission for me to go to Fort Knucklebone. And then she should be able to give you directions. And you're going to also need a soul coin, or two, or four because the vehicle she'll lend you runs on soul coins. Does anyone want to take the soul coin or keep it? Sure. Uh, yeah. Thank you. Ooh, pretty. <laughs> Who wants the big one in case she gives you a very large vehicle? <laughs> right here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's all right. Be. <laughs> You've got the bag. Mm. Yeah, okay. All right. So Interesting. if you get a two-door or four-door, you're covered. <laughs> <laughs> Think of it as a, as a carriage rental, but infernal. Mm. Okay. Oh, we're going to have some really, uh, we're going to have some really complicated things about um, damage waivers, aren't we? Yeah. Yes. Oh, absolutely. Traitors <laughs> are hellish. Mm. Mm. Home of the lawyer. Which one of you can stay awake after the third page when they go through that because you're in charge of the rental? Sorry, everyone's taking this really well. I'm having a bit of a breakdown. We're in hell. We're dead. We're going to chase a goose, and I'll then everyone's just like, this is cool, this is fine. Yeah, yeah cool. we're just doing it. Bit of a yeah. breakdown, I'll hand you a drum. <laughs> I so so it ever. Throw it into lava, like, no! <laughs> <laughs> no! Yeah, yeah. I also, I caution you, be careful as you walk down to town. Um, and she points toward the river Styx. Ooh. Should you fall into the river Styx, it won't matter, because you won't know anything anymore. Oh. You won't know who you are, you'll lose all your memories. And mm. you'll just be wandering lost here in hell. It sounds like a Saturday night. <laughs> I don't know what kind of nights you had as a mortal, oh, but I don't want to lose all my memory. Okay, fine. <laughs> okay let's you just did, go do you? the thing, I guess. You fell into it just that once, that night of the gig. Oh, God, no. It must have been. That would explain everything. That's the everything. only explanation. Yes. Oh, no, I remember everything, my friends, the rivals. I did push one of the people I don't like in the sticks, though. It was funny. 
<laughs> and then, memorable, laugh, but, yeah. like, and then when they climbed out, they didn't remember I pushed them in. It was great. <laughs> oh, so you don't die. You just forget everything. Correct. Huh. Oh. It sounds like fun. I'm so, I mean, if your yeah. life's, if your unlife's really crappy, I've seen some people just kind of jump in and go, hey, oh, YOLO. Okay, fresh start. Yeah. That's interesting. I, I don't don't know. do like, it. Can I, like, put, like, a, a pinky in and <laughs> I like, forget, like, the last 10 minutes? No. Okay. Um, Very good question. Before we set off, what does this Mad Maggie look like? Uh, do you all know what a hag looks like? Oh, yeah, I know. Yeah, 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 my yeah. time. Uh, Maggie's a hag. She... Haggy, yeah. Haggy, Maggie. 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 Yeah. If it wouldn't hurt, I'd throw this D20 at you. <laughs> <laughs> um, but she, but you know, she's she's dressed like she's there for work. She's not in the usual hag attire. She's 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 a businesswoman. She's ready to come and do work. And um, you'll you'll know her shop by the by the smoke billowing out of it. And you can people see it from here. It's all wow, you have really good vision. Thank you. Yeah, perceptive. <laughs> So basically, this list points you toward the path down to this town. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, before she, she turns to go and go back to her un, undead shenaniganry of a fallen paladin, do you all have any questions for her? Can you tell us a little bit about the, the dreaded beast's powers? Oh, have you encountered a goose on the mortal plane? Not one quite so fierce, but they... They have struck fear deep into my heart. I've seen a their soulless dead eyes. A chicken. And similar. their weird tooth toothy beaks. Mm. Oh, chickens are hilarious compared to a goose. Unless we're talking about abyssal chickens, then you don't want to mess with oh, them. Yeah, no, 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 those are different. Abyssal yeah. chickens are horrifying, and I say this as someone who's lived in hell for quite a time. Mm. Mm. Am I correct in thinking the infernal goose is related in species to the horrible goose? <laughs> it could be, except Imagine if the horrible goose could shoot flames out of its beak. Oh, okay, that's good information to know. We should know oh, that. Yeah. Okay. An armed horrible goose. Can it, can it fly? It. Yes, it's a goose. Oh, yes. Okay. okay. Can it swim? It's a goose. In, wa in, in lava? Oh, in the river Styx? I'm in not the river Look, look this is too much reconnaissance for you doing me a favor. You all, <laughs> other, okay, other than how you got here, aren't you all experienced adventurers? Don't you know how to look up things? Don't you have an almanac? Nope. Let me look. Uh, Something. Can I look, at, can I look in my bag of holding for an almanac? Sure. <laughs> kind of just wing it. Okay. Do yeah. I need to roll anything, or do I do I just grab an almanac? Uh, roll, and depending on what you get, I'll tell you if it's success or fail. Okay. <laughs> uh, I rolled a nine. Do I add anything to this? <laughs> add your perception. Oh. Perception. Oh, that's a sixteen. <laughs> Lo and behold, wow. Volo, Volo's guide to creatures is in your bag. Hey. Oh. oh. Um, I mean, thing. I wouldn't mind taking a look at the war <laughs> bar. Of course, I'm here you go. Up. Thank you so much. All right. Just All right. Wait. So uh, you find the entry on the Infernal Goose. It's a terrible creature. It is, it is monstrously sized. Big boy. It is very large. Large. It is going to um, think of you as a snack should you find it. Because mm -hmm. you're mission. I'm a snack. We're a snack. Yeah. <laughs> you are a snack. Yeah. You are a piece of popcorn. <laughs> yeah. I think that's a, a snack. compliment. <laughs> you pop it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, exactly. I'm popping. You popping? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And buttery. <laughs> so you're gonna, you're so own. you're gonna go down easy for the goose, is what you're saying. <laughs> I go down really easy. <laughs> <laughs> I've heard that. <laughs> okay, big boy. You know what? No, that's you. Wait. <laughs> I'm getting confused. Wait, big boy, flame. Uh, weaknesses, that's what we want to know. Weaknesses. Oh, that part's smudged out, sorry. Oh. Oh. What did you do to this <laughs> Two butterflies. All right, oh. so, all right, unless you have other questions, Lisa's getting sick of your shit. <laughs> do you have any final things before she goes back to what she was doing? Uh, if we make it, uh, we, uh, will we see you again? Like. I don't know. Okay. All right, wh why you ask her? I just wondered if we would see you again for no reason, but we could hang out. <laughs> oh. You know, you're not subtle. Just say what you think, Anne. You want to go on a date or, like, what? I don't know. <laughs> if you don't get out of here, sure. Oh. Okay. This All is right. going to come Either through my yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, don't let, that, don't let that stop you for going back to the mortal world. But oh, hey, no. if you... I fell in the river sticks. <laughs> Wait, no, no. no. But, see, no. <laughs> but see, if you fell in the sticks, then you wouldn't remember I you asked remember me for exactly. a date. Yeah, yeah. So then you do but it then again. she'd get to see you for the first <gasps> time all over, over again. Over again. Um, this is getting weird now. Yeah, okay, 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 we'll go. <laughs> these are kind of strange. I'm a purveyor of fine goods and rare items. I've never seen one of these before. What's, what's a soul coin? It has a soul in it. Yeah. 
<laughs> but no, really. Really, it has. And as you hold it and, and are start examining, you hear a horrifying howl from it. A screech of the damned comes yeah, from the Yeah, keep that away from me, it's let's, out of tune. Let's get this done quickly, guys. Shall we? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Yeah. It, it calms down once you stop moving it around. Right. All right, so Celise bid you good luck. She heads off. Farewell. <laughs> and you all can start heading toward town. Do you want to do anything between the plateau and the town you're headed toward? I am kind of curious. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to admit. I, I wanna, what, what else can I see? Oh, you can look around. Yeah. So the hellscape, you know, there's, there's red dust rolling around. You, you see and hear the river sticks as you get closer. Because I've heard so much about it, you know. Mm. I mean, Finally it's, here. it's yeah. here, it's beautiful. beautiful. It's beautiful in, in a the creepy, winter, you know? dystopian way. The pictures never do it justice. Right? You know? Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know, you can see strange flying creatures off into the sky, like, not close on top of they are, but, you know, there's just some, not what you would expect. So, like, mm. in the real world, you would see, like, bats, things like that, dragons, smaller dragons, small <laughs> things flying around, birds. These are just creatures with too many legs, too many wings. Mm -hmm. But you don't quite know what they are. Okay. I had a poster like this once. <laughs> Did it tell you hang in there? With too many wings tall. Oh. <laughs> Can I roll perception to try and find Gwen as we walk? Oh. Help action. Please. Sure. Yes. Yeah. Oh. I, I could just play the song again and see if. Oh, oh, oh that's a natural 20. <laughs> quick, 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 quick. <laughs> the dice are provided where your DM to have it. <laughs> As you're walking, you hear a, a strange little snuffling off in some scraggly bushes. I recognize those snuffles anywhere. <gasps> could it be? It could. My heart sings. <laughs> uh, I power Let's slide head. over to Glenn. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and Glenn pops out of the bush and makes a little inarticulate demonic noise because they're apparently happy to see you. <laughs> Amazing. And then, they, and then they kind of look at you expectantly like, yo, song, what? <laughs> <laughs> sure. So Please you're from the Too Many Wings tour. <laughs> Hang on a minute. I'm just going to have to see if I remember. Yeah, I didn't fall in the sticks. Cool. <laughs> Stop shredding. <laughs> All right. So, so you've got Glenn back. Yeah. Remember, you are responsible for the care and feeding of your Glenn. Okay. Mm. What do you eat, Glenn? That was probably not the question. <laughs> I was going to ask something different, but sure. I, I, the DM meant that I, right. Oingo Boingo is yes, responsible Oingo for the care and feeding I'm of going Glenn. To take out, I'm going to start taking out all the supplies we have and trying to see if Glenn, and which ones Glenn enjoys the most. Glenn just takes them and eats them. Oh, okay. He's going to eat everything. Oh, wow. This is great. The growing boy. <laughs> you, look uh, you, you, you take your arms away, your hands go on, you're like, oh, no. <laughs> While he's stuffing his face, I'm going to ask him, uh, do you know Mad Maggie? Hmm? Ah, is this home? Hmm. Uh, do you want to come for a fun ride? Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. We have a guide of sorts. Mm. Yeah. You've yeah. now got a demon. Congratulations. Hooray. Yeah. All right. So, let's, <laughs> should, we, should we try and find yeah, yeah. 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 it? <laughs> <laughs> kind of strangely mesmerizing here, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Should we just stay? Oh, yeah, we yeah. can just stay forever. Vibe. It's definitely got a vibe. <laughs> let, let's try and find support. this smoke stack. Yeah. yeah. So, so hang on. Has Glenn picked up a has picked up the scent for the trail? Or he's just up. I think he's just oh, up for hanging Glenn with us. Glenn is a demon, so home. Avernus it's not is home. home. No. Yeah. Unless he fought in the blood wars. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know. Maybe he worked his way up from a yeah. 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 Oh wow. Well done, Glenn. Yeah. It's really hard to come back yeah. again. You know? A real social climber. And literal climber because he's on your shoulder. You, know, you and Glenn aren't much, yeah. aren't much yeah. Yeah. inside. It's a good thing I have a 24 for strength. <laughs> um, but we're heading in the direction that Celise has pointed us. Yeah, so you yeah. saw the town, you, yeah. you, and as you make it down the road, you've got the sticks on one side, you've got the creepy but beautiful landscape on the other, mm -hmm. and you can see this town. And, you know, unless you're going to stop and do other things, you, you enter the town. It looks kind of like villages you've all known as mortals that you grew up in, you know, maybe kind of Menza Baranzin, that for you. But it's got a very still aura. Mm. You know, normally towns are very lively, bustle, especially in what would be kind of the middle of the day. Mm -hmm. Time flows differently there, but it feels like it should be busy. Mm. And it's busy, but in a 
it's quiet, but too quiet way. Like you, you see people, you see forms, and it, but as you get closer, you realize, oh, these are like skeletons. These are zombies in a way, kind of used to be an Aarakocra here, used to be a dragonborn there. This is a perfect uh, moment for, a, for an album cover. <laughs> I, I have painting supplies. Can I'm I well paint? ahead of you there, my friend. <laughs> yes, we are here in Pisich. Please. Oh, are you really paint trying away. to paint? Yeah. Do you know how long painting takes? Uh, look, I'll do, I'll do a quick rough draft now, and I'll fill in the details later. Yeah, I didn't say it was going to be good, but like... <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be quick. Yeah. I just need to know, you know, the layout of the, of the skeletons and the zombies real quick. He's <laughs> doing it. <laughs> just <Right>. for that. <laughs> oh, you're going to give me a check for this. Yes. Um, what would it be? Would it be performance? Yes. Oh, cool. Um, yes. I'm how well can you, how well can you sit there and, and sketch? So to your right, there's a couple zombies. <laughs> Having it's having a lively exciting. conversation as lively as zombies can. I am definitely throwing bardic inspiration towards you for this. Yes. <laughs> uh, is that a D12? We won't need that. I think so. At so. level 20, yeah, it should be a D12. Yeah. Hot dab. So yeah, give me a performance plus a bardic inspiration. Okay. And plus proficiency, I guess, because I'm proficient. Sure. Okay, cool. <laughs> I just want to. I'm envisioning you s pulling out an easel out of this bag, mm -hmm. and, and standing there, you know, quickly drawing this for charcoal. Okay. That is a 25. It's not Van Gogh, but it's enough for you to, ha to be able to go back and sketch it should you survive this job. <laughs> we got it. We got it. Yeah, yeah. You'll get it on the next layer. It's cool. Yeah. Do yeah. you, you even attracted a couple onlookers who are kind of like, what's, what's going on over there? <laughs> What's the vibe? Is it friendly? Yeah. It's, it's the, curious. It's like, ah, oh, they're newly dead. They're okay. probably lost. They'll work it out. Can, yeah. can, I, can I chat to one of the zombies? Sure. Can try, try. You can try. Hello. <laughs> hey, what's up? Oh, oh okay, cool. Uh, I didn't say that we're inarticulate zombies. Yeah, I know. Yeah, that's why, yeah, that's why I am here. Uh, hey, I'm Iggy. These are my friends. We are new. Uh, yeah. well, so... What's going on? What's up? How are things? What's you are so down? new. <laughs> yep. They even like sniff a little bit. You're like, oh, okay. you still smell more. Okay. Well, thank you. Uh, maybe. Uh, wait. Is that a good thing? I don't know. Are we gonna decay? Eventually. Oh. Yeah, it's kind of one way to hurry this up. Going. Yeah. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, All okay. right. Get to the um, hack. Hang we're on. We're looking Let for Mad Maggie, by the way. Object device. Asking bar. Yes. And sure enough, you see a bar behind the zombie. Huh? Cool. It, uh, what's your name? Zombie. <laughs> <laughs> it suits you. Yeah. It I really suits it. your whole look and, and, and that. Yeah, great. I guess I'll go look for Zom A and Zom D. <laughs> Iggy, please. <laughs> well played. <laughs> You're lucky I just ate. <laughs> yeah. Because right. there yeah. was about to be some comment. Uh, <laughs> On you. Oh, yeah, physically. Ow, ow, stop. Okay, I'm going. We're going. We're going. <laughs> All right, but you, you see the bar. Do any of you want to try to talk to any of the other creatures you see around? or? I'll talk to anyone who looks my way. <laughs> so does the bar resemble what we've been told Mad Maggie's looks like? Does no, this, okay, is a, this is a proper bar. Uh, okay. You know, the kind of... I'm going to just hang back. I'm going to sort of hide. So you're going to hide in the bar? If I can, yeah. yeah. Just to try and be very nondescript yeah. and just you know, not be seen. All right, so you all enter the bar, and you know, it looks like any other kind of bar you might have patronized when you were still quite mortal. You know, you find a nice dark corner, you put your shades on, you're okay. chilling. Um, I'm you doing see exactly the other thing, which is going to look for the stage. Yeah. Yes. If they have one. They've oh. got a very small stage. So It'll it's, do. It's like the once a, one night a week, there's the, I guess we can have karaoke kind of bar. Um, so you can go up there. We're going to see if they let you perform, however. Uh, but you see a, a tiefling bartender that's very smartly dressed, lovely curved horns. They got kind of a bluish skin. And they're just minding the bar, chatting people up, serving their drinks. And they look up and notice you, but they wait for you to approach the bar if you choose. Yeah, I just think my way over. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> hey, we're new. Uh, <laughs> Hi, new. Nice. I'm dad. Uh, <laughs> all right. Uh, uh, <laughs> we're looking for 
Mad Maggie. Uh, I'm not Mad Maggie. Oh, uh, well, we tried. <laughs> Go to leave. <laughs> Are you looking for Mad Maggie? Yeah. All right, so I can tell you exactly where she is, but you all look very fresh off the mortal plane. Yeah. C mm. Can I get you a refreshing drink or something? What's in it? Tell me what you like. I have alcohol, I have fire water, I've got the finest whiskey in a furnace, I've got plain old water, but as you can imagine, it's not gonna be very cold. Ice doesn't last long in here. Mm. Mm. I mean, the, the fire water on the mortal plane, you know, it's, it's, it's fine, it's a bit weak. Um, if you've got some strong stuff, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll take a look. The finest whiskey in Avernus. Is it better than the last time someone told me this was the best whiskey somewhere? Because That was I me. I told you that, um, I think. Oh, yeah. No, no. I wasn't yeah. talking about you. I ignore oh. you when you say oh, okay, that. Oh, okay, okay. Well, okay. Yeah. Um, I don't know what you're talking about, but I only serve the finest spirits. And I'm dead. Are they literal spirits? Yeah. <laughs> like, are we it could be. Oh, I'll take that. So you would like an, a spirit infusion is what you're saying? Yes, please. All right, so uh, your bartender turns around. They make you a, a drink that is like dark and bubbly, but it flames as they pass it to you. It is literally fire water. Oh. <laughs> For you. Thank you. A purple, cloudy Oh, that was mine. Oh, sorry. Drink. Okay. But you hear a sad little moan as they top it off. It is, you said spirit infused. Yeah. It has a spirit. No one said it has to be a happy spirit. Oh, okay. Um, I'm gonna take one of my little parchment tabs and rub it on my skin uh, to get some of my toxin on it and then drop it in and just say, here, soak this in, it may help you feel better. You'll discover yourself. <laughs> and then I'd like to see if the moan changes at all. First off, you have deeply offended the bartender. <laughs> I'm sorry, was my drink not enough for you? I'm just trying to make, I'm just trying to help the spirit out. So you waste my good alcohol. I'll like slip it and I'll be like, mm -mm, what? This is no, some and then fire. The no. Just <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I tried, I tried hey, to help. Hey, hey look, friend, I was just trying to give out some free samples for the concert. Uh, I grabbed some more tabs of parchment uh, and hold it out like a, a stack of them. What's that? It'll, it's it, look, good it, stuff. It, just one taste and you'll see beyond. So you're trying to get me drunk while I'm on duty. Is this <laughs> what? responsible? Uh, yes, yeah. We're in yeah. hell. We thought it would be a bit more considerate. Why <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> This is my establishment that I take very seriously. You ruin my drinks. You offer me commonplace drugs. <gasps> How oh, dare. You have How never seen You walk drugs into such a my pub in my Avernus and insult me. Well, I'm yeah. ready my weapons at the You're back. You're insulting me right now. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's starting, I'm starting, I'm starting to get my, I'm starting thing, to get yeah. my proverbial froggy hackles up right now. <laughs> oh, really? uh, and and think, you, you do realize that the bartender has to look over the bar yeah. at yeah. you. <laughs> yeah, I'm just, I'm standing. I'll, I'll, I'll chest try and lift you up. Yeah, I'll like. Careful, careful, careful. Uh, you have to roll a, a saving throw when you touch me. I'm oh, no. <laughs> I'll do it. Uh, it's a constitution saving uh, throw. Okay. So Good wait, you have made it that. so no one can touch you? Yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately. Good. Good, good. No, that's so fine. I, uh, so this is why we don't try to be oh, actual saved. frogs. Okay, cool. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I, got, I did 18. I, I'm used to this. This is what we do. <laughs> oh. So now are you trying to be eye yeah, to eye? Yeah, I'm, I'm eye to eye. Although my eyes are sort of like spread, so I'm like, <laughs> you want to go? <laughs> and the tiefling just summons a sword out of the ether. Uh-oh. Uh, they, they're like, knock a few bucks. All right, baby, let's do this. Uh, uh, I haul off the, the, yeah, I'm going to haul off. Let's do this. And this yeah. Is, yeah. Okay. I'm going to throw you up. <laughs> I'm, I'm not going to wait. Special, baby. Baby. All right, are, are, are either of you partaking in this shenanigan? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been watching oh, it about waiting for this to kick off. Yeah. <laughs> I was going to wait for permission to play, but I'm not going to now. I'm just going to start playing. All right, well, go ahead. So you're going to play. You're not in combat. No, oh, yeah, that's fighting music. <laughs> oh, so you're just being a bard. Cool, cool, cool. Okay. I've got to be ready when the inspiration needs to hit. <laughs> All right, so roll me initiative. Tell me what you got. Dirty 20. Also dirty 20. Oh, my God. Oh. All right, who has a higher dex? Oh, uh, you do. Yeah, I will. Yeah, I'm you definitely do. do. So, okay. <laughs> and then what about you, Thorn? Um, I got a 17, but I also get to go twice in the first round. So if I minus but that you have a plus initiative, 10. yeah, no, I've added a plus ah. 10. So it'll be a 17 and a 7. 
And then because you're playing, I'm going to let you be last, but you can still yeah, be part, part of this. Oh, no, that's we have to find my initiative on it. All right, uh, first up, anyway. Iggy, what you doing? <laughs> well, see, hmm, okay, I'm gonna now go ahead. these characters. Yeah, actually, I'll do this. I'm gonna use my panache. Uh, Ooh, so cool. as an action, I can make a persuasion check contested by a creature's insight. On a, su on a success, the hostile creature has disadvantage on attack rolls against targets. I can't make opportunity attacks against targets other than me for one minute. All right. Yeah. So I'll make a persuasion check, I guess. Uh, Good luck. Okay, thank hmm. you. That is, I'm just, I'm just sweating at this point. 26. Well, hell. <laughs> <laughs> Hells. Uh, Oh, we're, in the, yeah. we're in one level of oh, Vargas. Yeah, oh, yeah, we're yeah, only on the fifth level. The first level. <laughs> All right, well, you know, my tieflings, my tiefling bartender's good, but they're not going to get past that. Sure, sure. So uh, I will have disadvantage whenever I go. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Unless it's at me. Uh, so, uh, 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 yeah, if it is a hostile, it's, char it's charmed by me for one. It is hostile. Okay. And as a bonus action, I'll just, yeah, I'll bonus action hide. Sure. All right, you, you do your dirt and then go hide. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Oingo, what, what are you doing? Um, I am uh, I'm in full toxic positivity mode. Oh. Uh, I'm going to bonus action oh, rage. Oh, so you're, you're a streamer. Yes. <laughs> he is. <laughs> hey, guys. Oh, wow. It's so good to be here. Uh, thank you all so much for uh, donating to my subathon. Uh, no, but I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna look at I'm gonna look at the the bartender and I'm gonna say. Um, you know what? You bring so much tension to this place. There's so much tension around. You just gotta let go, let free. You know, I know you're upset to be here, but you're just gonna have to accept it. You hear me? Accept it. And then I slap them in the face. <laughs> <laughs> with a poison. Uh, yeah, oh. with a poison yeah, yeah, yeah. hand. So do I need to save for yeah, the poison? Yeah, you, you have to do that <laughs> if I hit, uh, which I'm recklessly attacking. Nice. Uh, that is a 25, <laughs> 23. 23. No, no, sorry, 34. Wait, what? <laughs> 30, 30, 33, I was wrong. I got a plus 14 and I rolled a 19, so it's okay. a 34. Oh, you're just like, oh, just a 34. Uh, yeah, 33 to hit. So the only way I'm beating this is with a nat 20 then. Uh, well, no, that's just a hit. You have to make, you can, it's a DC 12 to avoid uh, yeah, the the poison. It's but you're getting the damage from the slap. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> This is what I get for using fancy dice that I cannot read. I did not make that. Uh, oh, really? That's 15 plus 7, uh, which is 22, plus 8, uh, which is 30. That's 30 damage uh, from the slap. Oh. I just slapped them real hard. <laughs> oh, right. sorry, 34, because I'm raging. Of course. Oh, one, one more point, thanks. Yeah, <laughs> that's all you damage. needed, now they're dead. So, <laughs> all right. You had enough? <laughs> I got one more. You met thunder. Lightning's on the way. <laughs> you brought hands to a sword fight, buddy. Ooh. You know what? All right, I'll give you another taste. Uh, I'll haul off and I'll Wait, go do you get another. a second attack? Yeah, I have two attacks because I'm a, a All right. level 20. <laughs> <laughs> uh, does a 21 hit? Barely, but yes. Okay. Uh, that is going to be another uh, 4 plus 4 is 8 plus 6 is uh, 14 plus 8 is 22. So it's going to be 22 points of, oh, sorry, 26 because of the plus four. Uh, so 26 points of uh, damage. Some of that's force, uh, some of that's just slap. Uh, <laughs> uh, and because of, my, uh, because of my toxin, as it touches their skin, there's a sort of mesmeric effect. Uh, and this is essentially me describing my ancestral guardian feature, uh, which means that they actually have disadvantage on all attacks that anyone against me, which means, I guess, technically, they have disadvantage on all attacks. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Your bartender Hell will yeah. remember that. <laughs> <laughs> Tag team, baby! Don't All touch right. me. Thorn. I don't want you to... Oh, yeah, you're right. I'm, I'm hidden anyway. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. From you? Because mm, I'm at the back in the corner. <laughs> um, I'm, at, I'm still... Well, Thorn... You are Thorn. Yeah. The bartender is still behind the bar. It yeah. is dazed and confused, thanks to these two. <laughs> it, under, uh, how far in feet? Like 20 feet. Oh, I don't get to use my crossbow. Fine. <laughs> so, I mean, crossbow should be. Cross uh, it would be a disadvantage, wouldn't it? That close. No. Uh, you'll allow it. Okay. I'll then crossbow it. it. Yolo. Yeah. I'll allow it. Yeah. No. 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 Not for much longer, maybe. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That's uh, a, a twenty-one. That hits. Does that hit? Oh yeah. 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 Um, Barely. Um, yes, we unless it might be a sneak attack. Yeah. Yes, I was hiding. 
Oh, absolutely. So that's 10 D6. Do you want to borrow this as well? Yeah, do you yeah. need extra D6? Yes. Yeah, I'm like, here's some... Here's no, some I, I was prepared, because nice. this okay. will get tedious quite quickly. Plus... I'm like, here's some D6. Plus, plus, a, plus a five, because why not? <laughs> Well, haven't you die in the hell? You like go down to the next ring, or like what? What have we got? We've if you all, if any of you die before you resume yourself, you're just gonna become a lemur. Oh no. Okay, I see you mm -hmm. two. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we've got a five, two fours. Okay, that's uh, thirteen. Thank you. Um, <laughs> and then a six. Nineteen. Nineteen, and then two. Eight and another eight. Uh, so 19 plus 8 is uh, yeah, 27. 27. 27 plus 5. Oh, 32. 32. Did you add? Did you add the crossbow damage? Uh, yes. yes, that's okay. the five. Oh, no. <laughs> so you know this poor bartender that showed up to run their business. <laughs> they were having a great day until you lot walked in. They were. Oh, thank you. <laughs> they were just merely offended. They weren't trying to throw hands until you started this shit. <laughs> that's right. You're the one who gave me a sad drink. You asked for it. I just asked for spirits. I didn't ask for my spirit to be lowered. <laughs> you need to go out and touch grass. There's no <laughs> grass for you to burn Oh, I can find you some grass. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm just here sipping, like, because <laughs> I'm still drinking the drink. I <laughs> the shoulder. Yeah, the bartender's <laughs> just kind of like holding their shoulders, just cussing an infernal because they are a tiefling. I just should have stayed in fucking bed, let the place <laughs> close, <laughs> God damn it. Uh, what are you doing? Because now the tiefling's going last, and who knows if they'll hit oh, anyone. No, no. Hmm. Oh, can I, uh, are we done? Can I order my drink now? <laughs> Is that your turn? <laughs> Is, are you asking for a drink? Would this, would this poor tiefling, not with a crossbow bolt in their shoulder. I mean, we weren't in hell. <laughs> <laughs> but we fit right in. <laughs> I've been served by a headless bartender before. I'll tell well, I aren't tell you, you just special? <laughs> no, you can't have a bloody drink. I don't want a bloody drink. I want to try the. I want to try this fine whiskey you have. Do you know, while you're having that conversation, I might try and sneak around to get you one. Mm -hmm. If you're just in that conversation, mm. well, you get another that? turn anyway. <laughs> don't you sleight of hand. Mm -hmm. That's going to be difficult because they're looking right at you now, especially since you've shot them in the I shoulder. Thought we out of, I thought we were out of it's all right, combat. Just, no, because the tiefling hasn't gone. Oh, right. <laughs> I, thought we, I thought you were done. All right, I'll go back to hiding as a bonus action. So all right. <laughs> we the tiefling's going to get one attack or try to. <laughs> fine, fine. No, I don't get involved. So, so is that your action? That's your action is to yell at the <laughs> Yeah, thing. yeah. I'm just doing it. Well, I, I, I put in an order and I'm playing. What, what, whatever that works. <laughs> They just, <laughs> they just give you a rude gesture. <laughs> they give you two fingers to leave. Yeah, that's right. Double. Thank you. <laughs> no. You know what? This tiefling is sick of all your shit. Oh, yeah. yeah so, um, even though you shot the tiefling, you've now hidden mm -hmm. in the dark. Mm -hmm. But you're right there. That's true. Yeah. But you have disadvantage on... Bring it on! It's true. You do have disadvantage. I know. Oh, and that was an at 20. Of course, I get disadvantage. <laughs> I cannot read that. Son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's still, it's still a, it should hit, but it was just ridiculous that I had to lose the nat 20. Yeah. Um, well, that's so, they've got, they've got dual moon touch swords, and then, so does a 24 hit you? It does. Excellent. <laughs> What's your armor cost? 19. Uh, cutting wood? Oh! Ooh. All right, for the benefit of the audience, what does cutting words do? Cutting words. <laughs> Basically, I get to, as a reaction, I get to just be like, hey, you, get, get, stop it. I say something, basically, and I get to take some of that, take some of the damage off of it. There it is, ha ha. Uh, creature I can see within 60 feet, makes their ability, blah, 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 blah. I subtract, I roll a die. I roll a die to do it, that's what it is. Yeah, and while you do that, the, I'm going to be rolling my yes. damage. Yeah. yeah, so you might end up missing. I might. I, I might indeed. I'm going to Oh, roll. it's a six, so it's minus six. So 24 minus six is an 18, which means, unfortunately, the attack misses. Oh, so it's not off my damage. It's off the initial yeah, it's attack. Off the, it's yeah, it's off, off the, the attack. Well, shit. <laughs> yeah. But I'm not hitting anymore, so, you know. Yeah. yeah, I mean, I do get another attack, and oh, look, you just showed I up. I just showed up, and you have disadvantage against me because of what you... <laughs> I mean, I'm still going to roll two yeah, yeah, attack. Yeah, I'm still going to roll... Are you going after them? Yeah. Why? I, I, I just <laughs> wonder. 
Uh -huh. <laughs> Note, out of character, no one asks that if they don't intend to do so. <laughs> I see you. Ooh. Ooh. Um, this is hilarious. I got literally both 19s. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, sorry. So uh, now you have not done your cutting words again, I'm going to guess. Or does that apply to this attack too? It's, it's a reaction, so I can't so do it again. You've got your reaction, ha ha. Yeah. So with that, uh, that, does a 28 hit you? Yeah, Me? just about. Yes. Oh, or you, you either of you. Oh, either of us. It depends. Well, dep if you are attacking, if you're attacking her, I can do something to interfere with it. If of you're attacking me, you then can. I'll just take it on the chin. <laughs> it's up to you. It's hmm. Yeah, which <laughs> <you prefer. laughs> She's not fate. <laughs> I'm gonna roll a d6 and see who's hey! attacking. Okay. <laughs> which one of us is gonna get one? It's gonna hit you. Oh, okay. Because right. you deserve it. <laughs> it's true. I'm All a right. Rascal. All right, now I'm going to actually roll some damage for you, and hopefully these uh, legally distinct mm -hmm. uh, weave-flavored dice. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's see, so, oh. goodbye. <laughs> did you jump? Oh. <laughs> oh, we killed him. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we did it. <laughs> so 14, so 10, I don't know if this is gonna, no, the goose he's is. Very, he's bottom heavy. The, yeah, the goose is just kicking He's back. very surly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. He's got a real attitude problem. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, the goose got served here. <laughs> so 24 oh, damage. Did, 24. Is that uh, bludgeoning, piercing, or slashing? Slashing. Okay, then that would be halved. <laughs> I'm raging. So it's 12? It'd be a toxically positive, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 All right, so you've taken 12 damage. And after that, the poor <laughs> tiefling who has a bolt in their shoulder, mm -hmm. who is tired, all they want to do is serve drinks and, and be nice to people. They just like grab a bottle of whiskey and almost throw it at you, but they just kind of slide it down the bar and just hold it really out. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> in a smooth, in, in a smooth motion, tip the tip the glass off, <laughs> pour the double. Yeah, yeah, whatever. One shot. And so they 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 just kind of like they grumble and they're like, "I'll be back. I gotta clean this wound. <laughs> Don't <laughs> burn down my bar while I'm gone." Wait, are they going to clean? Yeah, they've Are given you disengaging? Up. Oh. Yes. yes. <laughs> I, For you. The, I'm disengaging because I've got a bolt in my shoulder. <laughs> Look, I just want you all to fucking leave. Yeah. Hey, this is really yeah. good. <laughs> you know what? Just take the whole bottle. Just get out of my bar. Okay. You know what? This does feel I, just like home. So it really does. I, um, will, I will throw a purse. You're throwing a coin. The tip. Oh, it's a bag of coins. I'm, I'm not broke. Wow, you just missed that <laughs> lobby right there. <laughs> um, can I, before we leave, can I see if, if the mood leaving? of my drink... We're having so much fun. Oh, yeah. <laughs> can I see if the mood of my drink has improved at all as the, as the bartender walks away? Oh. I guess. I'd like to just check back in to see if, if they're feeling any better before I drink. Did you I tell us where Mad Maggie is? <laughs> no. Ah, uh, phone. I know. That she wasn't Mad Maggie. <laughs> no, <laughs> I... Hey, phone, you've got to try this. So, you all... I mean, the, the poor tiefling is just right, like, there look, there do you mind if, I hold on to that if you give me time to actually clean up and not be standing here bleeding out of my I'll, shoulder. I'll, I'll, give, I'll give a cheeky healy word. I'll, I'll help uh, out. Keep your magic. I don't want your help. <laughs> you can't be complaining if, if we're okay. offering you Look, <laughs> I'm trying to be nice to you. This is nice? Oh, wow. Only because there's four of you and one of me. I, yeah. That's the only reason. That's true. All yeah. I have is 293 hit points left. <laughs> if it was just you and me, I wouldn't stand a chance. <laughs> I reload my, my head. <laughs> slop, slop. Hey, hey, hey. We got what we came for. But she did it. Except, except did. the important bit of information that we came for. <laughs> We're not going to get that now. Leave, <laughs> leave a bit of merch on the table and we'll just. We'll I don't watch your merch. I don't recall asking. <laughs> no. So I got how sales works. <laughs> I, I pull out a life-size cutout of him and set it up next to the, along with the. And I just cut it in half. <laughs> I've got a good arm left. I just cut it in half. Well. Do you all not know how this works? What? What works? When you want information from someone, you don't insult them and then attack them. Okay, so that was on him. Okay, let's, why don't we start over? <laughs> I was insulted first. Hi, I'm Iggy. These are my friends. Uh, so you need better friends. Hang on, that's where we did start, wasn't it? Yes. 
Yeah. We were fine until your diminutive friend here insulted my drinks. That means you're small. Yeah, no, I know. Cool. You know, you can buy him a dictionary later. We don't have time for this. Oh, he's got an almanac. Mm. It's true. That's not a dictionary or a thesaurus. Yeah, you probably have a dictionary. Mm, you have one of these in here. Yeah. No uh, one cares. I, okay. I roll a three, try to look pretty. <laughs> yeah, I guess. All right, look. Yeah. You all want to know where Mad Maggie is? Go yeah. ask someone on the street. Just get out of my bar. Oh, please. Oh, well, we can do better. I'm than sorry. That. Do you think please works in a furnace? <laughs> You can make the sad little puppy eyes all you want. Just get out of my bar. Can I roll the persuasion? <laughs> no. Oh. If, you, if you tell us, then we'll leave. Yeah. They oh, say. no. I've got friends I can call, and we could make this an even fight. Uh, okay. And that then you, like she just does a piercing whistle. I mean, I was just going to say, this is the first time ever someone has said that, uh, that has said that one of their drinks is the nicest it is the finest available, and it's actually been this true. This is it's really good. And this is how you do it. Yeah. yeah, I really like Your the fire. Your friend was, insulted fire my drinks. Yeah, I was going to deal with that later, but this this needs from good this enjoy needs and good unhealth. I just think that now, maybe constructive criticism is what we're talking about. It's opposed so to you all seem to have ignored the fact that she just made a very shrill whistle. Yeah, and oh, no. do you want to hang out? After I feel like what? No. So <laughs> as you all are trying to convince this tiefling. <laughs> And annoying her more and more yeah. and more, <laughs> four rather large orcs come oh. to the door. Hey. Ooh. They hey. are hale and hearty. They don't look a bit undead. Oh. They're like six, seven feet tall, oh. all Ooh. armed for bear. They're security. Ooh. Do you need any more people on security? Because, like, you've got to kind of, like, you need people in the bar because, you know, <laughs> you... Because if you call them afterwards, you're already shot. I think we've missed those. Most people don't come in and shoot me. Yeah. Mm. yeah. You know, most, this is a peaceful establishment until today. This is a British. I don't understand. <laughs> okay, we're leaving. Yeah, we're, it's fine. We're going. We're so going. you can either talk to the boys. Drink. We're going. Yeah, I'll take my drink. No, walk. she takes the drink like, no, oh, you oh. insulted my drink. You can't oh. have this. Oh. Get out. Oh. <laughs> you come into my bar and think you're going to insult me and then take the drink? Okay, we'll go find the other bar. What Hang other on. bar? There's you missed one. Bar. What? Oh, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> it is, as the drink is taken from me, does it seem happier? To be getting away from you, yes. <laughs> <laughs> this bear okay. was chilling in his bottle, Job it well was done. fine. <laughs> and now you've disrupted its way of unlife. A you know, you're, well you're one of those healthy people that gives advice when no one asks, aren't you? <laughs> it's toxic positivity for a reason. Oh, so you're a Twitter <laughs> follower. <laughs> Yes. That's what you are. Mm -hmm. You're the rando that no one follows that thinks they know everything. <laughs> uh, wow. That is me, yes. That's yeah. Me. Yeah, it's, yeah. It's like we've met. <laughs> <laughs> I've met many like you, and most don't get out of the bar alive, or unalive, shall we say. Yeah. Mm. All right, well. All right, I'm just going to slip past yeah. these guys. Uh, excuse me. Excuse uh, me. Excuse me. <laughs> Uh, yeah. I make a point of patting each of them as I go. <laughs> <laughs> just, just very good. You, yeah. you are living in hell dangerously today, my friend. <laughs> These orcs literally tower over you by two or three times your height. You know that, right? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Oh, oh yeah, I like it. No. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. I don't have that many cutting words. <laughs> I can't do that. So one I'm of the three, kind of as yeah. after you pat them. They return the favor, huh. but because they're a giant orc, they just slap you right out the door. Uh, <laughs> it's like the fresh. A, it's like the fresh con save. They yeah. slap me. They're an orc. They're like, <laughs> I got a sneaky feeling they're gonna make it. Yeah, they yeah. 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 All right. I'm tumbling away. So we out now. <laughs> you all are out of the bar. <laughs> you have made no progress on getting to Mad no, Maggie. Absolutely not. We've got an hour and a half left, so actually, if we can get. <laughs> Uh, I was gently gonna, hinting that we want to, you know. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what we're going to do is we're going to um, bring the house lights up. There is a loo to the left for everyone. I think there's some oh also no. out there. <laughs> <laughs> Look, there's bathrooms over there. I'm trying. I'm trying oh, to. Oh no, 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 no! We're still stuck in. Yeah, we're still stuck in yeah, a furnace. Yeah. <laughs> you did this to yourself. We did. We did. We did. We did. We did. We did. Uh, so while we reconvene, while we get a little refresher and some water, uh, take ten minutes. I'm going to start a timer. So be back at 9:35. Um, let them know that you're in the theater. Bring, we're going to bring up the house lights. We're going to go take a break and see you back in 10. Woo! All right. All right. The people don't trip and die, please.
lights.
Yeah. So, she oh, we're back. Hello. Hi. Hello. 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 Welcome back. I know, a private Thank conversation. Thank you to everyone <laughs> who's been hanging out. If you, if people come in, just hopefully they'll be quiet as they come in and they can find their seat because it is dark, but I can't see y'all. Um, so welcome back. We've had a little break. Hope everyone is refreshed, having a good evening, and hopefully we're entertaining and hilarious and funny. And if not, <laughs> yeah. <What's up? laughs> excellent. Let's All right. Face. So um, when we went to break. You all had a uh, pissed off the bartender, not got the information you needed. <laughs> yes. Sorry. Uh, got in a fight. But we did swipe <laughs> the best whiskey in hell. Hmm? You did. And you well, little you fella, did. you can well, have a little shot. Yes. We didn't swipe so, it. I we, swiped we, it. We acquired it on the cheap. Sure. Um, <laughs> open your little mouth. Ah. Look, 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 look. Right, are I'm you? not going to touch him. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You're right, you're right. That's what you're How's that? Delicious. Told you so. Great. You can have one oh, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 No fire water, but it's, yeah, it's good. It's good. Oh, yeah, I'll yeah, have yeah, that back. Yeah, Thank yeah. you very much. Yeah, Put that in the back yeah. pocket. That was very right. important business that needed to be done. Yeah, yeah. Sorry. Now, if you if you remember, <laughs> Solis did kind of give you a hint as to where Mad Maggie's place smoke. Is. Yes. Correct. <laughs> yes. Thank you. Do any of you perceive a smokestack or smoke in the sky? May I try? Of course. Yeah, yeah, yes, and me. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> I'll be your lookout. Oh, wonderful. All two foot three of you. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, get, I'll get on top of uh, Glenn's shoulders. Yeah. Do so we you're poisoning Glenn. I feel like he's probably immune. <laughs> you, oh. don't, you don't know that. I got, hey, I got an extra 20. Oh, there you go. Yes. Yay. Yes. <laughs> you spy with your eye. 34. <laughs> you can see back to the mortal plane. Hey. Oh, there it is. Oh, it going out. Yep. <laughs> so, but you do manage to see a smokestack chugging along, um, and you hear the noises of engines and other machinery. And that uh, that might be what Felice was talking about. I know where we need to go. Yes. It's, it's there. Okay. It's going oh, okay. Yeah. Let's okay. do that then. Mm -hmm. Let's ride. Yeah. So unless you all manage to insult anyone else along the way or have any other fights, you find Mad Maggie's Probably. business. Yeah. I don't know. It, it's you all are having a great track record right now. Let's remember our rogue training, shall we? Yeah. 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 We sneak. Yeah. Awesome. Sneaky sneak. Yeah. So you you go in and you see some some air crocra working in the yard on some engines on on something that looks basically like. If someone had mutated a carriage into the most infernal, demonic-looking vehicle you've ever seen, it's got what looks like a steel grill, but also spikes to kind of catch anything that might be in front of it. It's got wheels. The wheels have large spikes coming out of it. That's one. That's one machine that Eric Coker are working on. You see other what could be could have been humans at some point. Not sure. It is hell. They're working on another far larger machine. It looks, you know, it's got like eight doors, weapons on it. It's, it's definitely something meant for war. Um, Thorne's going to pull the uh, sword coin out of his pocket just to see if it has an effect. Are Is you it? going near any of the machines? Well, we, we can see them, right? They're you can see them. We close? We're like 10, 15 feet That's away. enough. <laughs> just enough. Yeah, I'm going to pull it out of my pocket and see if it d changes the coin in any way. No. No, OK. No. Mm. Interesting. Yeah. So you, you see an open kind of uh, office looking area. Okay. <laughs> Look, every businessman has it. Absolutely. Kind of absolutely. It's, it's very tidy down here. I wasn't Born. expecting that at all. Born. Well, it was till we got Born. here. Yeah. I've got an idea. Sure. You know how you've been, you've been, during our session, you've been telling me how you've been feeling a little out of practice. Yeah. Like you're not really the thief you once were. Absolutely. Do you think you could hotwire one of those things? Do you think that's a good idea? Seeing as I don't know what it is, and it needs the, the power of souls to run it. I have faith in you. <laughs> so do I. I think you should go for it. Yeah, you he know, could do it, but should sure. he do not it? Sure. Yeah. We, we, uh, could uh, just, we could just, could just fill out the find out Maggie. Work. Maybe work both plans at once? Maybe we find <laughs> Maggie. Okay, all right. Should we just I, do that? Yeah, okay. I Mad can, Maggie! I <laughs> Mad so, Maggie. Are you actually yelling out there? Yeah. <laughs> and a hag in some greasy overalls comes out. What you yelling for? Hey. Hey, um, what? Hey's for horses. You're so right, my Maggie. Um, hi, I'm Iggy. Uh, these are my friends. 
We were sent by Celise. Oh, uh, what, what the fuck did she send you for? Uh, she said that you could give us some men and we would be able to ride it out. Give you some what? Like a vehicle. You want one of my war machines? Yeah. Pretty please. Like the big one if that's available. You're a wee thing. How do you think you're going to drive that? I don't know. You work the pedals and I'll drive. You know. Yeah. I mean, I'm real strong. I can push him down. You. And she has to literally look down at you. Yeah. You can't even reach the pedals. What are you going to do? Let me drive. We've got experience, dear. Yeah. And Glenn to help us. What the fuck is a Glenn? <laughs> I just it's over. an open plane. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we have an open plane. Right you right little yeah. smart ass. I, I know what a Glenn is. <laughs> guys, guys, just, just chill. Yeah, okay. Let's not make the same mistake we made about 10 minutes yeah, ago. Yeah, yeah. Fantastic. Oh, Thank is you. that that why I heard all the fight? No, 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 that was some other guy. Um, yeah. So, yeah. Um, the whiskey lives up to the reputation, love. It is fantastic. I don't yeah. give a fuck right, about no. the whiskey. It's a business. That means you haven't tried it. Please. It's a business. Um, yes, I, I like you. Thank you. Know you. What, you know what's what? What's up? We've been sent on a mission by Celise to fight an infernal goose that I imagine is causing you a lot of trouble. She sent you on the goose chase, huh? She certainly did. Now, yep. we can help you out, you can help us out, everybody's happy. All right, what, what, what's in it for me? I'm gonna get one of the soul coin, just gesture for a soul coin. One of oh. you's got the big one. One of those. And Maggie just opens a pocket and you hear the jingle of many Amazing. soul coins. Okay. And I'm gonna take the whiskey out and go, and the best whiskey in hell. I live here, I can go get it whenever I want. And yet, it's so hard to get. <laughs> we had to have a fight. I mean, sorry, we had a, a disagreement. It was like, shit, we had a disagreement. It's like, don't stop it. You're ruining the vibe. We had a disagreement. The Eric ago, but, but <laughs> so, I guess what we're getting at is what's also in it for you is, um, yeah, you do this for us and we fuck off. <laughs> I mean, my colleague can make it very difficult for you. Otherwise, we do have a choice. Mm, yeah. Everyone's going to have a bad time, us included. So, I would go for the whiskey if I were you. Maggie just starts cackling, and a She's on side, fantastic. A, a <laughs> hag's <laughs> laugh is the most horrific thing. It's like music. Imagine nails on a chalkboard, but with very long claws. It goes through the chalkboard. That is a nasty sound. Mm. I think we're in, guys. I'm going to start heading towards one of the infernal edges. Come back, come back. I haven't agreed yet. Come back. All right, look. Margaret, what do you need? <laughs> Who the fuck is Margaret? It's you, dear. No, my name's Maggie. All right, Maggie. All right, look, I owe Celise a favor. She's already given you the soul coin, so I don't have to give you one of those. But it's on her head if I don't get my war machine back. Sounds good to us. <laughs> Hang on, this is called a war machine? Yeah. So is my next album. <laughs> oh, you are just full of inspiration today, man. This place it's amazing, is so isn't inspiring. <laughs> I started experimenting I think, with Can we get to the part where you fuck off? Hell, hell. You, just, you, just, you just give us your best war machine and we're gone. Lord. And Maggie points toward the sleek black one. Mm. Oh, right. Who's got vehicle proficiency oh, among yes. us? Anyone? That is a you? question. Do any of you have no. vehicle proficiency? You, you might be able to make it work uh, as a thief. You yeah, might yeah, actually yeah. Well, be able to. I've got to, the tools and yeah. uh, whether or not I, I think should. you have some kind of an ability that where you could just make, you could just At level 20, things. yes. Yeah. Yeah. Magical yeah. ability to drive anything. Yeah. yeah. For the sake of expediency, yes. and for YOLO, fuck it, you know how to drive this thing. Great. Well, it's, it's an automatic, it's not even a stick shift. Uh, Maggie, does it need the big coin or the small coin? Oh, that just needs a small coin, it's an economy. <laughs> All right, buckle up, lads. Boy, <laughs> I have permission to speak, is that, can I? You may. Thank you. Um, didn't Sully, Sully say that we needed like four or five coins? That. There's a question for Maggie. So they said we needed four or five coins. To How far are you driving? Like a, a ways. Where are it's, you going? We're going to Fort Knucklebone. Yes. Oh, you're going to need another coin. Mm. Oh, uh, well, I do have another one. one. Well, that's oh, that's not the right size. Okay. And then she pulls out another coin. Oh, oh. Thank you very much. Thank you. That Is that enough? Either. Yeah. Okay, go ahead. And okay, then, great and mileage. And then how often should I, because I know these things can get overpowered. Oh, you'll know. When it stops screaming, you'll know. <laughs> oh, amazing. Fantastic. All right, should we get in? Yeah. Let's go, Lee, get out of Maggie's hair. Uh, do, do you know where Fort Knucklebone is? No. No, no idea. No, 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 no. 
<laughs> so we had a map. <laughs> no. Oh, do you think this hell is GPS? No, no, we thought we had a map. We don't. I mean, you yeah, might. Yeah, I thought Glenn. Yeah. If I you could Glenn. just yeah, yeah, a little bit of paper out of my pocket and just put it with a pen, because it's going to stop this conversation. Yeah. <laughs> if you could just, my dear, be so kind. So you, you, have, you want Glenn to draw your map? No, I'm getting to you. Oh, <laughs> oh you want Maggie to draw yeah. your map? Yeah, little map. And only because she deeply wants you all to fuck off. Yeah, brilliant. That works she just for starts, us. She just scribbles the map, which yeah. is basically, look, it looks kind of like a pretzel. <laughs> if you unwound the pretzel and then try to put it together while before it was baked. Okay. It, it's kind of a weird squiggly eight and then a pretzel and then a very crudely drawn <laughs> building that looks like a fort, maybe. And she just scrawls N-U-L-B-N-E. Knuckle we didn't say Got Maggie it. was literate. No, no, but I know what you there. mean. There. Fantastic. That is such off. a good help. See you later. <laughs> All right, now we're going. So Come you're on, guys. So you're driving. I'm driving, apparently. Brilliant. <laughs> so right. I'm going to look for the coin slot, because I think there is one. Maybe. Get on that You can drum. help me DM. What? <laughs> get on that drum. So you've... Can you uh, get on the drum? Yeah, yeah, because it's the war machine. We need the drum. Oh, yeah. Uh, you can uh, sit shotgun with me and sure. just go for a whoop. Oh, you got, I mean, I've got like a bunch of other, I could play the saxophone. I've got like a bunch of other. This, this, this isn't a saxophone kind. Yeah, it could be. Right, I'm going to start not. revving the engine Perfect. now while we're talking. Um, yeah. So yeah. Once, get out once you rev the engine, because yeah. it, it's, it's a push button. I told you. Oh, it's right. Yeah, no, sorry. It's new and sleek. It's a push button. It's got great mileage. Fine. And as you press the button, a slot lights up on the dashboard. <laughs> a little display pops up. Look, we're modern in Avernus. You got the best one because if it doesn't come back, Salise will pay the price for it. Y'all don't care about that. So you see the, the lit up coin slot. Okay. All right, guys, you ready? Buckled in. Seat belts on because we do have seat belts in this car. Mm -hmm. We need Glenner in car seat. Yeah, okay. I'm going to put that. Gen just very gently put the coin just kicking our little inside the slot. <laughs> and you hear a roar of idle as you start the car, mm -hmm. well, the war machine. And uh, the gates open so you can get out properly. You don't you know there's a way to get out while you're in a vehicle. And uh, you know, you're off to our four knuckle drum. Amazing. And um, Iggy, you're up front with me. So I'm gonna give you the map. Oh, uh oh. We're gonna be going quite fast there. Uh, yeah, okay, <laughs> no, I got it. And then you, uh, yep, uh, okay, we missed that. Nope, we're good. All right, that's fine. Uh, do I need to roll something to follow the map? <laughs> you know, I'm not going to do it's that. It's a pretty simple map, I think. <laughs> it's a very simple scrawled out map. Mm -hmm. And as as is long term adventures, you can't read a map by now, you're in trouble. We are yeah. in trouble. You can read a map. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm, I'm not going to make job. you roll for map reading. That's silly. Yeah. So you you make it. Luckily, nothing happens to you for now. <laughs> and you see approaching a fort in the distance. Imagine any kind of like old castle type fort building any of you might have seen before and it's kind of foreboding it's gray it's it's i almost said damp it's not damp because you're in hell yeah. um it's very dry it's it's bone dry yeah and as you approach you see kind of a line of people going in and out you see so what are clearly soldiers you know humans tieflings orcs all kind of beings you see dragonborn here and there and you know, you, it's not big enough to just drive through the gate. We're not, they're not gonna let you just roll in like that. But you do get kind of the, the halt, who, who are mm -hmm. you, what do you want? We're here to slay the goose. The what now? The goose? And they just kind of look at each other, look at you, the goose. The goose. We're friends of Celise. Who's Celise? Oh my God, she played like oh a boy. huge joke on us. This is the worst, okay. <laughs> is this a, literally a goose chase? Is this no, we know what the goose is. Oh, you didn't say That's that? What okay. We're okay. For. Uh, yeah, we're, we're here to sleep. But we that. also just want to make sure that you're not just weirdos who come in to get into the fort. Oh, no, we are. We're totally. Yeah, we, we, we are. Yeah, yeah, no, no, we're totally weirdos. We are, but, but we're not, we're not we here to You're basically goose. not here to cause, well, you're going to cause trouble if you find We have a mission, and, it's, and the trouble is with the goose, not you. Weirdos with yeah. good intentions. Yeah. That, those don't go together. And from what they I hear, you, you need all the help you can yeah. get. So well, I don't hear about the goose because it's yeah. in the bottom of the fort. Go, go with deity of your choice. I hear Lysander needs help. <laughs> all right. um, you know, you you also get your spent co soul coins back. One of them has half a charge. Yeah, they're they're just in your pocket. So, this these guards are amused because people have come from far and wide to mm. try to slay this goose. It has not been slain. Mm. It's just chilling in the bottom of the fort. And 
if you can get down there and slay it, whatever you've been promised, I'm sure it's worth it. And they're just like, go with God and anime, have fun. What's up? This ghost isn't causing you any problems. No, my post is here. Mm -hmm. I don't have to go in the sport until I go to sleep. And my floor, I'm on the top floor. I don't have to hear the goose, see the goose. But your comrades. Oh, I'm sorry, you thought there was loyalty in hell? Oh, no. Oh. But at any point, you could be in their place. I could, but you know what? I could be a deserter, too. Okay, I get the vibe. Look, this, is just, this puts a roof over my head and, <laughs> and some kind of food in my belly. I, I don't see, we're pragmatic. Food. Exactly. Does this help? I'm going to give you the, the, what's left of that soul coin. I mean, what is it you want me to help with? Are you trying to bribe me? <laughs> Perhaps. And what is it you would like? I want some tips. I want to know what these weaknesses are in this, this goose. Well, if we know the weaknesses, we'll be dead. I mean, it seems you're quite amused watching these adventurers die, so we don't want to join them. So if you can help us in any way. I mean, you're, you, you're up front. I like you. You, you must have watched a couple of them. Uh, you must have watched a few of them and sort of thought, oh, really? <laughs> Yeah, exactly. I, I don't get close enough to see the goose taking them out. All right. Mm. But it, we can hear the screams occasionally. Mm -hmm. From the goose or them? Both. Mm. Mm. The goose is usually just having a good meal. The screams are when they get eaten. You've been here a while. Well, what would you do if you had to face it? I wouldn't. Mm -hmm. But that's me. Mm -hmm. I, but, but if you really did. <laughs> mm. um, you really think hard right now. <laughs> I would take... Hmm. I might take a scroll of magic mystical, since we know those don't miss. Might, yeah, have some, yeah, yeah. might have some fire, some ice. I mean, it's a bird. You could cook it, right? Uh, wait, wait, mm -hmm. it's, I mean, you say that, but the thing is, it doesn't seem like many people have been able to slay the goose. Did Nobody's been able to slay the goose. I'm just wondering what makes the goose so insurmountable. If I knew that, I'd kill it and get the, sure, get the king's I'm just, ransom. Sure, yeah, absolutely. There's a king's ransom? Worth of gold. Whoa! Hey, hey. Track, boys. <laughs> We've got like a sub-mission inside of the mission now. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what we do. But you know what? I'm just gonna, I'm gonna walk you downstairs so that no one stops you, and Thank the rest you. is up to you. One moment. I give him a t-shirt. So, <laughs> nice. Smooth, I like it. No, 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 not that. But, oh, oh. yeah, we might do it in a minute. We may need some... He burns it. Oh. <laughs> All right. I, your hard work has been yeah. I don't know if I These could be a couple magic men sell. You happen to know anyone selling any? And he, like, dramatically pats the pocket. Nah, mate, sorry, can't help you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I mean, it's, yeah, it's a fort. There might be stores somewhere. I don't know. It's a fort. Surely it's there's a, a commissary. There might be some weapons or something. Right, okay. How? All right, let's, um... How accurate is that map of yours? Is there a, like, store? No, the, the map ask. got you we got here. No, that's the map. Oh, that map. Yeah, the map oh. got you to Fort Knuckle, though. So we need another How map. about you, you just make it a little easier for us to get to this commissary? Oh, I can just point you at it. It's right there. Don't Perfect. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Thank you and he's kind of like, it's right there. You, if they'd looked up. <laughs> we were in a very deep conversation. Oh. <laughs> if it was a goose, it would have been us. Yeah, I know. Right. We, should we, we should didn't we get this the... far by being sensible. Exactly. Yeah, I mean, you are here going to fight the goose, so I can't argue that point. That's true. Right. <laughs> Thank Sir, you. Sir, before we go, what, what's your name? None your business. Uh, None your business. None business. Beautiful. Beautiful. It's been a Beautiful. real Beautiful. pleasure meeting you. It hasn't yeah. been for me. Get out. Okay. Nobody likes right. this here. I think yeah. we should, yeah. Okay. All right. Should we um, talk I strategy or should we go to route. the commissary? Show? Uh, we can look at the commissary. I mean, like, uh, if they had, like, a, a goose slaying sword, that would be really helpful. That would but, be uh, very helpful. Yeah. What are we looking for? What have we got and what are we looking for? That's what have I heard anything? Have we got anything that could, we could just... I got these hands. You I have. Got, you got those loving hands yeah. to wrap around. <laughs> hands. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> around the goose can catch them, you know? Yeah. Um, I'm... Okay, so the only thing we've heard so far is that the goose can breathe fire. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now, Maybe some out of its beak. Fire That's important to know. Yeah. Specifically out of its beak. Okay. So if we get away from the beak, like behind, perhaps on top of its head or behind it at the base of its neck, maybe a goose could have a difficult time hitting us. Okay. That worked fantastically for us with the dragon, if I recall. <laughs> True, but we didn't get behind the dragon. So we just stood there surprise, and took it. Perhaps. You raise a fair point. Okay. Yeah. I've got some magic. Uh, <laughs> I can cast it. Let's go buy some weapons, shall we? How about I mean, we don't get... don't you all have weapons? Uh, I, got, I got weapons, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah I've got yeah. some, but... I bring out, like, a whole, like, artillery. This wasn't like, the original artillery. Job, <laughs> I'm afraid. So but, because Tanya we said get, we could have we legendary weapons, so I took some. I got eight loving fingers. 
Let's go to the shop. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Raid the storeroom. Yeah. I mean, you wanted to do that anyway, let's face it. Sure, sure. Yeah, you two look for weapons and we'll be here. Come in. We can, we can, we can uh, run interference. No, 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 no. Even I know we're not splitting the party yes. at this point. <laughs> yeah. We can run interference, distract while they sleep. No, no, no. no. We're, we're just Don't you all have money? Uh, this no, is actually. Yeah. No. True, but you do have that one big soul coin. Mm. Oh, no, oh, now we found someone who does want a soul coin. Interesting. I didn't um, say they want it, but you do oh, have a soul coin. We do have it. Okay. okay. All right. Okay. Well, you have to do it fairly. And it's, a, it's a supersized one. Oh, it's true. It's uh, so should we should we walk up and ask yeah, for whatever they, they have that can defend us? Let's find out how much that will cost before we show them the massive. Yes. I put it back away. <laughs> yes. All right. Should we approach? Yeah. Yay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> We haven't got forever. We haven't got forever. So you all approach, and you see people buying things, trading stuff in, like trading in weapons to get repaired, stuff like that. Okay. People are coming and getting like armor changed out. So it's it's very much a buy stuff, trade stuff. If you're if you're assigned to this post, mm -hmm. uh, but there are civilians. It looks like they're trading and buying. Okay. So we're gonna need some fire resistance potions. <laughs> Maybe. Fire resistance, magic missile scrolls, what else? Oh, um, some means of some means of saddling a goose king sounds Yeah, amazing. yeah. A saddle. <laughs> yeah, a goose saddle. Yeah. A goose saddle. A goose saddle. Yeah. I'm sure, yeah. Yeah. I'm sure yeah. they'll have, have they got that sort of thing? A saddle? No, the other stuff. Oh, absolutely. This okay. is this right, is an good. operating right, port right. in hell. They have plenty. So, so as you all approach, you see a dragonborn clerk kind of like Come, come. I don't have all day. What do you want? Magic saddle. Saddle. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, a what now? A saddle. A uh, big enough to ride the goose. Saddle, yeah. um, a, any fire potions of fire resistance Why or any other no fire resistance items? With the saddle. Yeah, yeah. right? <laughs> and a scroll of magic missile. That'll be 5,000 gold. Or, or a bag of scrolls of magic missile. We only stuff. need three fire or, resistance potions, so yeah. knock that down a bit. One big soul coin? So 4,000 gold. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. How, how, what, how much does one big soul coin? That change left over then. Oh, they just smile and they grab like two scrolls and one potion. Oh, okay. So we're going to go down and slay the goose. It's kind of a big deal. Good luck. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, it would really help us out if you could give us a few bits and bobs to help slay the goose because then we'll be happy because the goose is slayed. How much are the scrolls individually? <laughs> They're pondering because now they know you need them. Hmm. Oh, I think once you oh said boy. that, we, we've seen the goose. <laughs> you must have known, but... Um, those, some of those scrolls are 500, 600 gold a piece. Because you might want revivify, depending on what you're doing. This is feeling like another quagmire. I think we yeah. should just... I, I, I'll, I'll take the... I'll hand over I'm, the I'm, I'm gonna how, how into conversation are you? I mean, because I might try and steal something. Mm -hmm. I will run interference and start bringing, I'll start bringing out t-shirts and merchandise and say, Excellent, now, right. I don't know if you were back. here the last time. I he wasn't, was and they just brush it off. So they're actually actively trying to get you to go away. Oh, okay. well, that's been happening the entire time. Do you want to maybe <laughs> play a song? There's, there's, a, there's a theme here. Oh, they'll just want us to go away quicker from the sounds because they don't seem I don't think they. I don't think, I think they'd appreciate music. But what I can do... In that bag, yes. magic mouth from the last gig. Yes, yes, yes. I reach and pull it out. It's a big old mouth. And with what? The, with it's a like a rocky horror picture show. Yeah, <laughs> like a Rolling Stones, like. <laughs> and I'm supposed to do what with that? Well, whatever you want. You're gonna be the coolest, coolest if, soldier in Avernus. If you can do us a good, if you can do us a good rate on the scrolls, we won't leave it on your desk. That's not how selling things I start work. rubbing, oh, it, I I start it rubbing its tongue oh, over the desk. Not, huh? <laughs> All right, we're leaving. Leave it on the desk. All right. <laughs> and I just shove it away. <laughs> Goodbye, tonguey. Uh, and they start just, the they, they get like, they, they summon a little helper to like disinfect everything. <laughs> oh, that's another Glenn. Wow. Wow. Oh. You didn't tell me you had a twin. They're going to hear that howling for weeks. I, didn't ne mm -hmm. I never got that recording right. Oh. Uh, do we, yeah, do we just head over to the door? Surely yeah, with all these shenanigans I can sneak in around the back. <laughs> sure. Sure. So are you trying to sneak and steal? Yeah. <laughs> That's all, all right. we got left. 
up right now. <laughs> All right, go for it. What do you, uh, um, what do you want to roll? It's going to be, because they are actively kind of cleaning off whatever this yeah. disgusting tongue did, uh, it's going to be a high DC, but see what happens. I'm going to perform, because we know this is, di we know this is distracting. What's the modifier? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Uh, whatever your dex is. Oh, Shay. I think you have, uh, like, plus 17. But it depends what we're doing. Are we slight of hand? Yeah. It's plus 17. Let's try. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah. So 13 plus 17. That's a 13. 20, 30. Uh, 30, 30. 30. 30. Yeah. Oh, Did yeah. We you, it? You Did it? we steal the heck out of it? <laughs> yeah. So you managed to steal. Uh, someone write this down. Yep. Uh, you get two scrolls of fire resistance, one scroll of revivify, and. Sorry, of. of revivify. Yeah. Oh, good. And uh, one scroll of magic missile at level six. <laughs> Excellent. So you get eight shots out of the scroll. Ooh. Ooh. Nice roll. Let's hey, level game. six. Magic missile. Yep. So, I shall distribute these accordingly. Who wants So, what? you've managed to steal things, you've tucked them away. Yeah. The, the shopkeeper's still just cleaning off things, just casting aspersions upon them back to the, back to Avernus, the deepest level of it. Mm -hmm. And, uh, yeah, you can now. So, that poor soldier is just like, I want no part of this. They just point toward, Excellent. <laughs> toward the, the way down. I found a new tactic. I think we're starting to get the hang of this yeah. now. Yeah. <laughs> See, I'm telling you, we should just steal everything. Uh, <laughs> you guys are free to, I have a lot of hit points, so y'all are free to take the fire resistance ones. Yeah, oh, great. And I'm already it's fire very resistant, optimistic. so I'm good. So you oh, two can... We've got an extra one, then. I'm not going to argue. Cool. All right. So we've got three um, between us. Mm -hmm. I'll take the ribbon fly, because hopefully I can feed over him. Uh, did we get the saddle in the end? <laughs> Did you all really want a saddle? I yeah. think you really wanted one. Maybe we can, we see a horse, they might have one. <laughs> no, you just not stable. So hold on. I you need did, to. you managed to nick a saddle? No, no, I don't think I did. I think we're going to find a horse. <laughs> no. That might be the easiest thing to do. Oh, no, I've Are you gifting reason. me? I'm gifting it, oh, however. Oh. oh, gosh, at what cost? What at the cost of whatever that tongue licked, it licked the saddle. Oh. Yeah, but you're riding it, so yeah, yeah. it's okay. fine. So and you did this to yourself. Yeah, poisoned no. saddle. <laughs> One disgusting saddle. Disgusting saddle. Mm. Oh, it fits in with the decor. You can it. smell what the mouth ate last. Uh, you did it? this to yourself. <laughs> oh. Congratulations. You played okay. yourself. Okay, Thank that's, you. that's oh. yours. Right. And then who wants the magic missile? Anyone? Anyone want to be a... It'll, it'll, it'll go nicely with the Eldritch Blast, so I'll... Um, yeah. yeah, you can have that. Thank you. All right, so you're armed, you're ready? Sure. Mm -hmm. All right, uh, the guard points you the way, and just everyone's, like, saluting you on the way, like, go, go, good luck with that. And as you keep going, you start to see, like, bits of skeleton and armor that probably were dragged out after people failed mm -hmm. soldiers. And as you get closer, you start to see the outline of an archway. It's glowing... Any of you with magical ability will feel something from it. Mm. Not malevolent or anything, but it's just you know this is a magical mm. door. There's no, there's no door. It's just like, enter this portal at your own risk kind of place. Do you all step through? <laughs> we need some sort of sneaking <laughs> to get through, I think, maybe. Yeah. Try no, it's and just, pass it's under just its a nose. magical door. Oh, I'm sure it's just yeah. a magical door. Just uh, we we, we, we did this thing. one at the beginning before of the adventure. We, yeah. <laughs> before we go through, I'm going to activate my toxic positivity and look around and say, Hey guys, I know it's been a bumpy road to get here, <laughs> but I am convinced that we are smooth sailing from here out. We're going to make it out with minimal casualties, minimal pain, Glenn in tow. We're just going to ride this goose off into the sunset. Because you know what? Our goose isn't cooked. This goose's goose is cooked. Let's go! <laughs> I feel toxically positive. So, um, you know, I, I, supposed to be the bard, so you know, I said to you ages ago that you could, so that, you know, you could lead armies one day. Um, and you Ooh. might lead them the other way if you have that kind of pep talk, but it's all good. Oh, we'll, we'll, we, we will ride with you because, you know, this is we've done the same thing. Oh, okay. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to have some sort of stealthy thing, stealthy cloak. <laughs> All right, you can stealth away. I'm stealthing. Yeah, I'll stealth in, too. I've got two songs for the album. I'll already. just draw as much attention as I can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're doing in. that. You're, ah! you're, 
<laughs> great face. But you were supposed to sneak around the back with a saddle. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll give the saddle to one of you. And then no, I'll no, try you've got the disgusting saddle. <laughs> That's <laughs> yours, I run the saddle outstretched. <laughs> you, I'll run into the room. Like you've got the job and the name of the second song on the album, Goose Rider. <laughs> yes! <laughs> um, so. When we were on the War Machine, did that count as a short rest? Ooh. You didn't do anything. Exactly. Chilling. Get a rest. Yeah. Uh, sure, sure, why not? You didn't yeah. use any spells. I don't know no, why you didn't. No, it's just my bardic inspiration thing. All right, I okay. guess. Because right. you're going to need all of it for the goose. Mm. So you, the noisiest one of the bunch, mm. you see a goose. <laughs> <laughs> a <laughs> large, large, large goose because <gasps> you're only two foot three. <laughs> Just it very close. Just yeah. looks yeah. at you and says, Honk, motherfucker, honk. <laughs> <laughs> honk! Honk! Oh, wait, was that not, was that, were you, was that an imperative or a declarative? No, right. Gosh. <laughs> that yeah, was a, you're in the wrong neighborhood now. <laughs> <laughs> Do this! Uh, I'll roll, uh, can I roll initiative to fight this goose? Sure. How far away is he from us? Where have you gone? Oh, yeah. Why are we No, no. You said you're rolling initiative. We are going for oh, it. Oh, okay. okay. Would you yeah. like to snap a fan? Sure. Let us, let us hope. Yeah, sure, yeah. sure. I need a pen, there we go. I have advantage on initiative, but it, it ended it, I got a 10. <laughs> oh, so. poor baby. Yeah. Uh, um, uh, 27 for me. 24, but also that first round, so 14 as well. Should uh -huh. go twice in the first round. Both of your turns are before mine. Okay. <laughs> wow. 25. Okay, so it's gonna be Liv. Oh yeah, ready to, ready to punch a goose. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm ready. This goose about to get slapped. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> I, I need to roll the for the goose. Look at it, slap the shit out of the goose. Oh, the goose has a 25. Oh, oh we're about to find out. <laughs> <laughs> so, Slow ass goose. <laughs> so the goose and Russ will go at the same time. All right. Have we got so Glenn? Is Glenn playing? Yeah, Glenn. Do you really want to put Glenn in combat? Oh, yeah. I mean, well, I feel that's up to Oingo Boingo because you've become so close to him. Yeah. You should ask him. Yeah? Yeah, I'm down. There you go. All right, roll for Glenn. He gets no advantage. Oh, he gets Glenn. no bonus. No man left behind. <laughs> uh, I'm, 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 not got a nine. I'm not in charge of Glenn. Oh, Glenn. Yeah, no, neither am I, so yeah. So go, Glenn goes right after me. Oh, oh. You. You, can, you can ride down together. Oh, <laughs> All right, so. <laughs> so it's just big goose. It's a big incense goose because it was just chilling, and suddenly there are these creatures in the place. It was sneaking really well. Yeah, it did. Um, okay, cool. I in like that case, a goose, not the goose. Mm. I suppose I'll just attack. How far away is it? When you first come into the chamber, you're about 15 feet away. Oh, that's close. <laughs> yeah, because it's a big old goose. Big goose. Uh, sure. All right. Uh, I'm gonna. Uh, maybe we start off with some some magic. Let's let's do that. <laughs> and All right. What would you like to do to the goose? I'm gonna. What I'm gonna do is uh, go on the defensive for for now. I'm gonna go in ahead and pass greater invisibility on myself. Um, I don't want that goose looking at me. <laughs> uh, before I before I do so, I'm gonna whisper to uh, Thorn. I'll be like. You get this goose, Thorn. Get the goose, and I'll give, I'll give you a bardic inspiration. Uh, <laughs> got a D8, and then uh, I'll kind of use my full movement to kind of get behind the goose. All right. Yeah, behind the goose. I wouldn't want to be behind yeah, the goose, but that's okay. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you gotta stick that saddle on the goose, don't we? Yeah, yeah no way. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I got the saddle. It's not invisible. Uh, yeah, no, uh, that's me then, I guess. Yeah. All right, your first initiative. Um, how close was I? Do you think? Um, were you once you snuck in? Did you do anything else, or did you just? No, go in the I was hanging back. And I was <laughs> doing All right, you're, you're about that same 15 feet from the Oh door. man, um, I guess I can hide at the end, but at least try. So I'm actually going to engage because <laughs> why not? Fight for a penny. Let's find out how bad this so is. So you're going to attack the goose? I think I have to. All right, how are you attacking? And who uh, took the scroll of magic missile? Oh, that was me. Okay. Yeah, thankfully it's not me. Um, Yes, I've got a rapier, um, and I think. I'm do I have advantage at the moment? Because he's seen everyone. I was sneaking. Mm, yeah. You would because you were cloaked. Yes. Phew. Nice. 
That's going to come in handy. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I don't have time to, to coat my, my uh, weapons in poison. I'm going to uh, start with a rapier. I've got two-handed fighting. And then mm. with a dagger, if I can get in close. So let's see if we yeah, I mean, this is out <clears throat> of the shadows attack. So yeah. you're going you're gonna to get it's some good great. hits, depending on what you get. Yeah. So I rolled a seven. So I'm you've probably going to need some bardic inspiration. Yeah, you've got the um, because, Well, let's see if it hits first. Yeah. Um, so rapier, 11. Well, that's not going to hit, is it? So that's 8. That does not hit. So, so, can I, is with inspiration? Could I run again? So sure. Thank you. Oh, it was a three. No. 21. No. <laughs> no. Oh, no. Well. So, you, so you add the D8 to the, uh, like you roll a D8. You add the D8 to your, your so D8. Oh, oh, okay. Is it 21? Sorry. Yeah, I'm 21 so used, Do you know what? I'm so used okay. to um, uh, it being a four or something. Yeah. yeah <laughs> um, I didn't think that. Yeah, so that will make it so you hit the goose. Okay. And that was an eight as well. Oh, so that's good. 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 All right. That's All right, a good so you did start. Hit the goose. Uh, How much damage did you do? I've got 10 d6 now. <laughs> so All right. So well, wild. while Plus Sam five. is doing math. Yes. <laughs> um, Please Russ, look away. Russell, what are you <laughs> up to? Oh, 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 that's a lot of damage. Oh, I'm... I'm going to I'm going to attempt to um, I'm going to attempt to command halt on the uh, on the goose. It may or may not work. If it works, you've got a you, you've got a chance at your saddling. Yeah. Um, it uses a legendary action to basically laugh at you in goose talk. What does a goose laugh sound like? Yeah. Yeah. A noise I will not make on this stage. Oh. <laughs> Can I try? That's yeah. two. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's the honk of nope. <laughs> uh, there you go. All yeah. right, so um, 32 damage to the goose. And then uh, with my dagger in my other hand, nice. which will be a smaller hit. Mm -hmm. uh, and that is 22. Barely, but Barely, yes. excellent. That's, okay. that's okay. fine. Uh, no. This is 1d4 plus 5. <laughs> I don't know if that scales well. up. Surely that scales yeah. up, but it's <laughs> fine. And that's a, that's a 3 plus uh, 5, so 8. Sure. Right. Why not? <laughs> and then I'm going to hide. Great. As a bonus action. Right. Thank You'll you. You'll never be seen. It doesn't even know. Yeah. I've probably barely pierced them there. In this All right. Uh, before you get your next turn, the yes. goose is going to go. Oh, sure. <laughs> <laughs> the goose is unhappy with you all. Why? Why? Uh, because we're here and everyone's unhappy with us. Yeah, that's, that's true. So that's true. true. People, People do not it. like us. Yeah, 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 the whole thing. Um, yeah. So the goose. People normally love me. I know, right? We're so popular. Since you came yeah. in yelling at the goose. In a toxically positive way. Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Oh, that probably doesn't help. I need to see what the goose's bonuses are. <laughs> My AC is a 19. Mm -hmm. Yes, but this is a kaiju sized goose that can eat you for a piece of snack. What kind of bonus has that goose got? Yeah. Wouldn't you like to know? I would love yes, to know. Yes, we'd love to know. <laughs> Strong plus three. It's I may tell you on D&D Beyond later. <laughs> um, so the goose barely misses you. Oh. You just feel like the 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 wind as it like chomps right next to where you are when you come ah. back. Do I make eye contact with the goose? Like one I eye, wouldn't. one eye, and it's one eye? I mean, you could try, but I wouldn't. Oh, I was just asking <laughs> if anyone <laughs> just one of those like, just like ha, one of those huge I eyes. and my foe have connected in this moment. <laughs> you truly are toxically positive. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, it is your extra, uh, extra Okay, so initiative. I'm going to crossbow from the shadows okay. this time. Nice. Um, yeah, is that a sneak attack then? Yes, please. Mm -hmm. <laughs> sure. It doesn't know you're there yet. Oh, thank God, it's a 19. So that's a 20, 30. Oh, yeah, 30. you hit the goose. Well, you you make an sure. advantage, though, right? Did you roll yeah, you might crit. Yeah. yeah, yeah, I mean, that's sure. Yeah. I'm not going to roll again. 19 will do oh, me. Okay, sure, <laughs> I was wondering if I mean, I call it. Isn't it 19 or 20 as a crit for sneak attack? No, it's 11. It's fine. It's fine. We'll find the first one. Wait. And 12. And this is this is the point Excellent. where you get to rogue levels where it's like okay this is just so much math this is yeah. this is yeah. I know this is it. Well, this is it. I think at level twenty you also get a free 20. auto crit if I remember correctly oh do you I, I think so this is also not D and D one hundred and one yeah. we're just having, we're talking amongst ourselves you just get to hear it thirty seven plus oh my goodness five how so, much yeah it's forty two yeah. yeah. well a nice yeah, number. <laughs> so y'all have done 84 points of damage already. Wow. And yet, the goose has not reacted. Uh, <laughs> well, the goose tried to chomp on him. It's How's true. the goose feeling? Just want to know. Just checking in. Emotionally. Yeah. Almost dead? Yeah. I've seen that face. That's a joke. Yeah, almost dead. That's an I'm just getting warmed up. Thing. Yeah, no, I know. That's <laughs> what I want to know. Oh. Have we scratched him? 
<laughs> a little bit. Uh, you might have pulled a feather out. Okay, fine. Okay, I will. I will uh, make sure I'm hidden. All right, uh, Oingo Boingo, it's finally your turn. All right, time to catch these hands, Goosey. <laughs> uh, I'd like to. I, I'd like to jump um, because. As a grung, my standing jump is just 25 feet, regardless of whether I'm running. So I'd like to jump wow. and see if I can land on the goose's back. You can certainly try. Cool. What do I, is, what do I need to roll to see? Athletics at a disadvantage. Okay. Well, I am raging currently, so that's, that's going to be a flat roll then. Um, let's see. That is a 14, and I get a plus 13, so it's a 27. <laughs> Somehow. <laughs> Somehow you just see this little grung just spring out of nowhere. Whee! And you do land on the goose's back. All right. <laughs> All right. Before I set this on you, I'm going to give you a little massage. Uh, and I'm going to, uh, I'm going to bonus action activate my Eldritch Claw tattoo, uh, which I think, uh, let, me, let me look at the exact. Uh, uh, what exactly does this do? Where is this a mandatory? Um, okay, so when I activate it, uh, for a minute, uh, each of my melee attacks uh, deals an extra 1d6 force damage on a hit. Uh, and also I have a 15-foot reach, which I don't need right now. I'm just saying that's my tongue. Uh, but I'm just going to start <laughs> slapping the goose's back real hard, uh, <laughs> recklessly. So this goose is like, I didn't go to, I didn't, this isn't the day for the chiropractor. What That's you a 30, no, I don't fit on 19, sadly. Reckless. But it is a, it is a 33 <laughs> to hit with the first attack. Yeah, I need to activate oh, on the first attack, okay. On the first attack, so the goose is going to take, uh, one plus three is four, uh, plus another eight, uh, is 12, plus another eight is 20, plus another four is 24, and I regain eight HP. Uh, Ooh, because of you my didn't blood. lose any HP. Well, I never, oh, I never took the short rest. Yeah. So I wanted to be able to do this instead. <laughs> All right. So how much damage is that on the second attack? Uh, on just the first attack, that is. Uh, I got the first attack. Oh, I haven't attacked yet uh, for the oh. second time. Um, oh, great. So I'll swing again. Uh, that is a uh, twenty-nine to hit. Yeah, that hits. And that is going <laughs> to be another Ooh. eight plus four is twelve. Uh, plus another 12 is 24, uh, and then uh, 24 plus 8 is 32, plus 4 is 36. So it's 36 with damage with the second hit. One of the goose's wings, you just hear a horrid snapping sound. Oh no! Because oh, no. you hit it right in the joint. And it's just, it's just, the wing just kind of flops. It's okay. It's, you can still fly, buddy. You can still fly. <laughs> just, just one, just, just wing it. Insult to injury. <laughs> I'm so killing your character. <laughs> I'm not really. I'm not the kind of dude. <laughs> um, so, yeah, you put a hurt on this goose Aww. that was just in its lair, chilling. Oh, oh, well, I'm killing the odds adventure. <laughs> like, I'm very aware of the fact that this was just a goose, and now I'm... <laughs> <laughs> I mean, now that, that goose bad. was in its... The goose was at home, chilling. Y'all broke in and said, where's the Netflix? <laughs> Share your password, <laughs> Goose. <laughs> are, are, have you done enough to this Goose? Uh, that is, yeah, that is the end of my turn. I think you've done enough. <laughs> All right. Uh, also, what is Glenn doing since you said Glenn was in the fight? Um, Glenn is going to take the saddle and set it gently on the Goose Aww. and start trying to affix some of the... the <laughs> the, the, uh, the roll, me a de roll me disadvantage because that is still affected by yeah. that disgusting tongue. What's oh, interesting that's true. is that Glenn is a pacifist. Uh, yeah. yeah. Glenn, Glenn is a, is a, is a demon. pacifist demon. Uh, I just rolled two 15s. <laughs> Glenn slides off the goose. Oh. Glenn, no! <laughs> you did this to him. No! Uh, does he still have the saddle? No, because if the saddle fell on him, it probably would kill him. No! Oh, that's fine oh. then. Okay, the so the saddle's like kind of half-assedly hanging off the goose's <laughs> back because also the wing is now dragging. Yeah. Oh, no. Glenn, seek shelter, Glenn. Uh, and we're back up to Iggy. <laughs> Avernus is like, the like a sad kind of like <laughs> evil. You know, I thought it was going to be like wild uh, evil, but it's just it's, it's just sad. Okay, uh, I'm going to. I'm gonna try. Does it, I'm gonna try and talk to the goose. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Uh, do you, Why? Do you? Okay. So do you, <laughs> do you speak infernal, or can you do speak with animals? 
Because remember, it is not a real, it's an animal, but it's not like a... It's an infernal. <laughs> it's, yeah. an, it's an infernal creature. If you speak don't, with I can translate. <laughs> can, can the goose speak with Thieves' cat? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, the, I don't think so. The goose cannot really speak because it is a goose. It has yeah, a I beak. Know, but like, maybe, all right, I don't want to... I feel bad about stabbing it. I don't know. Uh, you all I did this. watch this in, in the show. Yeah. So Eyes on the prize. I know. <laughs> <laughs> right. I'll Say what it. you need to. I shall translate. <laughs> it understands it's infernal. <laughs> mm. uh, okay. It just can't speak. Ah. Uh, and then I'll just stab it. <laughs> <laughs> so, wait. Wait. Oh, wait. wait what? Eyes on the prize. Wait. Oh, what no. happened to talking to the goose? I thought you said I could talk to Talking with violence. You can talk to it. It just can't talk back. Oh, okay. Then I'll talk to the goose. Great. <laughs> And, 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 I'm like, Wait. and you have a translator from whatever, oh, cool. from Thieves' Cant to Infernal. So what are you trying, are you trying to persuade the goose? Yeah, I would love to try to persuade the goose. Please, d give us, what are you trying to tell the goose? I'm invisible, so this is just kind of an ethereal kind of like voice echoing. Oh, mighty goose, uh, we stand before you and see your goosely power, and you, you behold our own power. Look at your wing, it's fucked. <laughs> And so I point. say to you, unto you, go uh, Goose, why don't we work together, and that way no one has to die. So you're trying to reason with a creature. I'm going to try reason. That you all just broke its wing, broke into its lair. Yeah. I was just loosening the tendons. <laughs> and look at what you did. This is why you failed chiropractor school. <laughs> don't remind him. <laughs> oh, I'm going to. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, you're gonna roll basically such a high DC. Okay. <laughs> cool. That's fine. Useful. I hope you got a really good <laughs> persuade. I mean, I do. It's yeah. just not your turn. Do I? Go for it. Okay. Might be the time. Yeah. All right. That's good. But, but you know. Do you want another D12? I I don't think I could get that as a, re as a reaction, right? Like. Or, I don't uh, know, except to touch. No, you can't no. add yeah. that after you've oh, already rolled. We still watch you suffer. Right. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll just suffer. It's fine. Uh, <laughs> I will, uh, that's a uh, 26. I oh. said it was a high DC. Yeah, I know. You, did, you absolutely did. I'll just keep trying. All right, that's your action. You're that done. toxic positivity. Oh, really no, it's not on me. Really, <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, in that case, in that case I will, I will um, I'll do a bonus action. And the bonus action I will do is going to be giving uh, you, Gemini, uh, a bardic inspiration, like, can you talk to the goose? It's not listening to me. <laughs> Please. It's a D8. All right, <laughs> and uh, that brings us back to Thorn. Straight back to the start. Okay. <laughs> um, I might, I'm just trying to work out how hold works. I might have to just um, It is a monstrous creature. Feature, but mm. it should work, but it'll be a high mm, challenge okay. rating. I might, because I've hidden, I might be trying to edge round the back mm -hmm. for this turn, which is about 30. I'm not quite sure the dimension of the room. Can I poison my uh, weapons as I do that as my turn? Uh, actually, applying poison would be a bonus action, mm. so you can do the poison in one attack. I kind of want to stay hidden for now, but <laughs> sure. <laughs> why, don't we cross, why don't we quickly crossbow and then... And go and back. And then get out, yeah. So and then you, can dis you can disengage. Can get yeah. Sure. Okay. Go for it. So I have, um, yes, a sneak attack because I'm sneaking. Go for it. Oh, good. Because I thought if that didn't hit, <laughs> <laughs> this whole conversation's moot. So that was a 17. That does with not an hit the goose. With an 11. That does hit the yeah, goose. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> a 28 hits the goose. Yeah, 28, thank you. We're going to work it out, actually. <laughs> I, well, I didn't know if you added your bonus already. Uh, um, so that's 10. Roadmap. Yeah, you know, 15, <laughs> 20. I think we can persuade the goose to be our friend. 31, 32, yeah. 32, I think we're making good progress. 36 plus the 5, 38 damage. Ooh, that's and then I'm going to sneak away and poison my weapon. <laughs> Bye. All right, so um, y'all have put a real hurting on this goose. I'm sure it has a bit of a reputation. <laughs> it does, but you know, you all have poisoned it. You Badly chiropracted it. <laughs> oh, I haven't got to the poisoning yet, have I? <laughs> no, 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 that's no, no, true. no. I haven't even rolled for that. That's coming. So yeah, right. and do you get an extra initiative every turn, or just the first turn? Um, no, no, it was just the first turn. Okay, yeah, so oh, I will yeah, scratch yeah. that extra one out. I think. 
Let me check. That would be insane. These are insane. I think it's probably not. All right. Anyone so in the audience? No. <laughs> yeah. um, so Just the first. Thank you. Yeah, All there right, we go. Thanks, because <laughs> I haven't played, would be over quick, <laughs> I haven't played <laughs> a high level row, yeah, so yeah, I don't yeah. know. No, uh, neither have I. Can you tell? <laughs> yes. It's your turn and then the goose. So just to check, magic you, wanted, missile. You, you wanted me to give this goose one chance at diplomacy, didn't you? And then magic missile it in the face. Give the goose a good talking to. And oh, magic missile doesn't right miss, there. so. Okay, I will. Yeah, and you're you're speaking infernal to yep. this goose. Yeah. Last chance, goose. Tap out. <laughs> <laughs> That's diplomacy. <Is> it? <laughs> <laughs> it, it seems to be in this group. Yeah. So no, I'm curious or thou. It's, it's been a while since the Infernal was spoken, so I, I, I feel uh, some nuances may have oh, been Oh, so you're rusty. Yeah. This is like trying to ask for food and then you get something you didn't order. Oh, yeah. Well, and you go, yeah, it's food. That's it. A Fine. couple of sentences. I'll get, I'll, I'll get my mojo back. But. You get, it actually kind of haunts at you angrily because it's angry and it's hurt, but it, it's, it's refusing to give up. <laughs> it's hurting. Oh, the goose is looking bad, but it's, it's not going to give up. All right. I did offer, so yes, magic missile. All right, uh, <laughs> that would be at level, are you using it at level six? I believe so. Wait, All right, then right. roll me um, eight attacks, and let me, if it, anything oh, over 23 will dice. hit. Uh, so it's a d4 plus. Yeah, it's plus one, I think, plus each one. one. So yeah. it's eight, it's eight d4 plus eight. Eight d4 yeah. plus eight. Who's got d4? Of course, you, there's one. All right, while we continue to do so math and mm-hmm. see if this kills the goose, do you need more d4? Yeah, we do. <laughs> this is why you bring extra dice as the DM, right? I just would love to oh, not, not, right. not, not, to not murder yeah, a goose. In, in theory, it sounded cool. But now that goose is in front of me, and it's freaking out, and I'm freaking out. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> now that the goose is loose. Well, the goose is loose, and, and I'm yeah. confused. Yeah. Disadvantage. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Are they plus eight each? Are they plus eight each? Oh, uh... Plus eight, yeah. Uh, plus eight overall. Oh, yeah. plus eight overall. Eight D4 right. plus eight. Yeah, that looks like it. Yeah. And that makes sense. There we go. The irony of all this is those are dice I made. Oh. So they're going to be my, uh, my downfall. 11, 11, 13, 17, 20, 21, so that's 29. Whew, this goose is almost cooked, y'all. Yeah, we yeah. need to eat. <laughs> How has no one done this before? I don't understand. <laughs> They're rubbish. They just didn't have our, our mojo. Mm-hmm. I mean, you all are well, very seasoned for explorers. Yeah. 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 You've got magic. I mean, that was just eight hit, or was, yeah, eight hit. Some of them are yeah. more. Yeah. All right. So the goose, the goose is struggling, but it, it kind of gets to its feet, and it's going to try one last major attack mm-hmm. on you. It's going to use a legendary attack. Of course. <laughs> it's going to basically trumpet up its head open, like trumpet up like an emotion, open its beak and rain down fire on all of you oh. in an enclosed space. I, mm-hmm. This is the one I was waiting on. <laughs> Did you two drink your potion? Yeah, yeah. sure. Okay, cool. Yeah. <laughs> <It's> resi- <laughs> but remember, that was resistance, not immunity. Yeah, yeah, still yeah. damage. Yeah. <laughs> so anyone who gets under a 25 oh take full damage. Okay. Oh wait, so what, what save is this? Is it safe? You so must get at least a 25. It is a legendary action. Oh, and, and what's the... Dex save, probably. Dex save? I yeah, dex. <laughs> uh, dodging, dodging the fire. Okay. Can I use that um, bardic dice you gave me for this? You can thing? use it for whatever you want, my friend. I didn't use it for this magic myself, because there's no point. Ooh. Okay, I've, uh, I've got proficiency, so that should... I, sh- I should, yeah. I failed. <laughs> yeah. Aww. Hang on, what are we rolling again? <laughs> Um, dex saving throw. Oh, dex saving yeah. throw. Okay. Yeah, because you're basically trying to dodge this fire as it rains down. Yeah, so my dex is fine. Well, just the finishing checks. Take that seven. Fine. And then six. Oh, dear. Mm. Oh, no. Oh. That'll be a one on that. Ooh. Well, And that's my, that's my big dice, so. Well, that was a fail. That'll be a one on that. That was yeah. a critical fail. It was. Yeah. Aw. <laughs> so. And 18 for me, so I failed, I think. Oh, darn. You all failed. Also 18. But, you're, but you are fire resistant, and you drank the potion. Yes. Mm-hmm. So, so, uh, so evasion. <laughs> oh, and I also have evasion. And <laughs> but yeah. I don't know, you can stack these. I've got uncanny yeah. dodge as well. I've got you can dodge things. or evade, but you can't, and you can't do both in the same way. Uh, yeah, so yeah, it's, it's always half. It's, yeah. So it's evaded, yeah. yeah. So yeah. you'll take half. Yeah. yeah. So for those of you that get nothing off of this, 
takes 70 fire damage. <coughs> wow. It's a 35. It's a big goose that it, spits it's fire. You, you did, it's a you did fire. build it up. Yeah. 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 It, it needs to get one attack in. Yeah. Yeah. So it's a 35 for me. So anyone who oh, yeah. has resistance, it's 35 yeah, fire right. damage. So You're crispy. Guys, I'm <laughs> almost below 200. So oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. You know that's not going to get you any sympathy <laughs> from the DM, right? Okay. So got the evasion, so However, half, 35, and then <laughs> right? fire resistance, so halved again, right? So, so like but that's 18. what I'm asking. Can, 18, I, can you yeah. halve it twice? Yeah, 18. You get Oh, it's yeah. fine. It's 18. Yeah, yeah. yeah but you, you still scratch. got a little singeing, and also yeah, you're sure. a drow. You don't like the light of the no, fire. No, I really here. don't. No, that's fair. So, Ow, <laughs> so, <laughs> so the goose is unhappy, to say yeah. the least. But it, it did expend a lot of its remaining energy to do this legendary attack yeah. on you all. Um, and it is now your turn, Oingo. Okay. I don't like that you just hurt all of my friends, goose. You know, I was gonna, I was gonna negotiate, but you... I do have to commend you. You've shown us something here today. You really have. Uh, perhaps a little bit too much, and for that I'm going to have to punish you now. Uh, and I'm going uh, <laughs> mean, to recklessly don't. attack the goose, just slapping it some more. What's the difference? I mean, don't right tell around. us. Like show us. That's, a, that's a crit! I need that's it. a critical hit! I know, it's painful, All right. I need it to see. Yay! So I have brutal critical, oh, uh, God. which means I add three more damage dice. Now so my question... Is? Uh, I guess, so it's going to be, okay, first I'm going to roll these, uh -huh. uh, and we're going to roll these twice, so that is, uh, and I also regain HP from these, so I regain 13 HP, oh, right. uh, I'm just going to write this down, <laughs> so I regain 13 HP, uh, okay. which is Good. force damage that is being done to the goose, that's 13, 21, 27, uh, 35, 39, plus... Uh, two more is 41, 45, 51. 51. And, and that's double because you crit. Mm -hmm. Well, that, that, that was why I oh rolled my. it twice. I rolled oh, it twice. So how much so is it's that? 51 from the first hit. Oh, Ooh. just the first hit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm mad. Here comes the second slap. Uh, you ain't ready. I'm yeah. not even going to bother to roll the save from that <laughs> slap. Um, and that is uh, 24 to hit. With that the does slap. hit. Okay. And that is going to be another... Where are you slapping the goose? Uh, so I've been working my way up, yeah. uh, up and down, sort yeah. of, it's back. No, so awesome. right now I'm sort of, I'm sort of like, I've climbed up behind the head and I'm hitting at the base of the head. Oh, God. So, <laughs> oh, so, you, so you're hitting it basically at the base of its skull? Yeah. Oh, okay. That's, that's, where, that. that's where it holds all the tension. Um, all right. <laughs> that's another 14. Uh, that's another 14 HP back for me, which is damage to the goose. So that's 14, 20, 23, 31, 35 with the second hit. And you, you, you hit it here in the back of the neck. Yes. You really did fail chiropractor school. <laughs> whoa, whoa. Oh, oh, no. Um, Say goose. Side so say goose upside your head. Say goose. <laughs> goose upside your head. Say goose, goose upside your head. Goose. Uh. So. <laughs> Sorry, it was in the moment. No. It, oh, I know. But you'll pay for it later. It. Trust me. I feel this blood. If I ever, if we ever play and I'm DMing, just remember that you have inspiration. <laughs> <laughs> and all of you will have disadvantage if we ever play together again. So, in the words of our friend. How do you want to do this? Oh. Um, I think I am just, I think I am like karate chopping, massaging this, this goose's neck up and down like, okay, let go, come on, come on, relax. Breathe into it, breathe into it. I could hear some tension in your throat when you breathed all that out. Uh, and then it gets to the top and then I, and the head just sort of lulls to the side. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Uh, uh, And I'm just trying to like Horror. hold, trying to just reposition and, the head. So and it as you up. do that, the goose, crashes to the ground. Ah! Give me a deck save to see if it crushes you. <laughs> oh, no, uh, that's a 17. Or 18, actually. Well, you're not dead, but that goose did kind of fall on you. You're hurting. Ah! Oh. You know, the, that, the, the, the hands that you want to rate you for everybody, one of them's broken. Ah! Oh, no! And, you know, it doesn't matter if you just killed the goose, so it doesn't matter if you gave it your toxic positivity. That's true. Yeah, I, think I the, need to see a medic. The tension you heard in its throat was a death rattle, so. <laughs> <laughs> I, I really should go back to chiropractic school. Oh, no, please don't. No, 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 no
with, with my hand. Can I get some healing, please? Just for my hand. I don't even need the hit. All right, so the goose is dead. (laughs) And once the goose kind of, well, literally breathes his last after you broke his neck, good job. And again, for a reminder that this goose was minding its business. We and yet we want to live. <laughs> oh, I know. I just want live, you all to so. feel slightly bad about barging into this goose's home <laughs> and killing it. I, if you couldn't tell, I was having a bit of a crisis. Yeah. The, just, feel, just to believe it. a bit it. weird about it. So, um, as this goose has, has now perished, you see a portal start to kind of form on the other side of the room. It looks large and glowy and blue. It looks almost like the doorway you walk through, except it's clearly a portal because once it formed, you can actually look and see the glen <gasps> where you all met your unfortunate oh, demise. Wrong glen. Oh, okay, yeah, I, was, yeah. 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 I swear to God. <laughs> what did happen to Glenn? <laughs> I mean, Glenn, Glenn is just kind of like laying there. <laughs> I'd like to crawl over with I one arm. I have to put a I have my hand. So, How's I mean. How's Glenn doing? Glenn? Bad? <laughs> no, Glenn is just kind of like, had the he's wind knocked out of him. Okay, mm. he's all right. He's a little demon. He's oh, good. Right. He's good. Yeah, he's I take the scroll, but... kill wounds I was going to give to you when I put it on Glenn. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, so. I nod proudly. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> can, I, can I pluck some feathers from the goose to make a, a nice soft bed for Glenn? Oh, that's thoughtful. This is an infernal goose. Why do you think it has soft feathers? Oh, well, Ooh. I mean, if it's harder, maybe he'd like it better. He's a demon. You know what? Uh, <laughs> you're like, game's over, we're done. <laughs> right. you, can pluck, <laughs> you can pluck exactly six feathers for your little demon. Oh, boy. Uh, uh, does anyone want a souvenir of the goose? Anything else? I would else? actually like to let a little look around, see if there's any secret treasure oh. in the room. Uh, give what me kind of a perception check or investigation, whichever's higher. Does it's anyone else want to look around the room? Yeah, got any eggs? It's going to be a perception. <laughs> Give me a perception or an Ooh. investigation, Jack. It's a 19 plus 15. Oh, 34. <laughs> All right, so um, Thank you. Ooh. those of you with, like, eyesight better than God. Yeah, yeah. that's me. Much like in a video game. <laughs> 31. Yay! <laughs> so you know when you hear a noise and see the outline of a treasure chest? Yeah. <laughs> you can't just go here. Oh. Yeah. There's a light shining upon it because you have such good rolls. There, there's I a massive treasure chest, and okay. upon the goose's death, it popped open like a will was read. Yay! <laughs> Didn't even have to check for trap. Right. Yay. And there is a bunch of gold, gems, a couple weapons. We Big can figure out what you all got sure. later. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> um, and as you're all pilfering and divvying up the, the loot, Celise appears coming through the portal from the mortal side. Hey, girl, oh. what's up? <laughs> <laughs> you gonna get that to eat? <laughs> oh, no, no wait, we survived. You, yeah. you nah. survived, sorry. I should have sabotaged it. Uh, I mean, you could always stay. <laughs> I'm leaving you all to the chest, by the way. I got what I came for. Both the... Um, uh, the, the, the loot and the tail of this goose. So oh, we're right. taking, the, tail yeah, of, we're taking the tail of the goose. No, no, not the tail. I've got a tail. So of not the tail. The tail. Yeah. yeah. It's like and loot and loot and tail. And yeah, tail. right. That's why I didn't say loot the first no, time. I know, yeah. Before we were go, let me paint. Because put one leg up on the goose. Yeah. Gonna make, this would be a great album cover for a sequel album. Uh, and I'd just like to hurriedly paint him another. Are you uh, using any of the blood that's spilled on the floor? Oh, yes, I. Yes, absolutely. I'm painting in the blood of the goose. The GM will remember that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just stuffing my pockets, not intending to share any of this with these people. Excellent. The last time I ever see you guys, it's been a pleasure. Yeah, 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 sure, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, yeah, so well. I well, scramble well, as much of it as I can, yeah. and, like scramble away yeah, like just, an old yeah. <laughs> See you guys. <laughs> so it's you great all knowing you. have you've gotten your treasures. You, you, <laughs> For whatever reason, you've now got a bloody sketch of defeating the goose. Got me eggs. Yeah. Sure, you found eggs. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but you, so you're taking eggs with you. Yeah. The DM will remember this too. <laughs> so, uh, Celise comes in. She salutes you. Well done. I didn't. I didn't know how this would turn out. No, neither did we, to be honest. Play it cool. <laughs> I am. I'll be honest, I didn't even hit it. I think this goose was just kind of like, I don't understand why people could. Don't worry. I. <laughs> she's so she's call... giving you the look. So what, what kind of look? I'm, I'm, I'm like playing it so cool that I don't even. Um, you've done what I've asked. I'm a, paladin, a fallen paladin of my word. 
which is a weird oxymoron. I know, but fine. <laughs> but you know what? In life, I was a not fallen paladin. I can do one good thing every millennia. It's okay. Oh, that's and uh, she waves generous. her hand, and the portal becomes clear. You can see your way home, literally, and just walk past her if you choose to go back to your mortal shell. Gwen. Thanks, babe, and I'm walk straight. <laughs> straight into it. Nice knowing you guys. Gwen, uh, stay in touch. Do you yeah. want to? Yeah. Give, me, give me a call. Take care. Yeah, sure. Gwen, do you want to? Do you want to come with us? We can have a whole bunch of new adventures. Uh. You, <laughs> <laughs> oh. Looks like I'm moving to Avernus, everybody. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> For what? For so something. <laughs> I guess. Uh, so that is a, uh, that's a 12 plus uh, 17. He's a 29. Yeah, so it's high. Uh, so what are you <laughs> trying to do? I want to try and steal the loot. <laughs> oh. 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 Wow. You, you got a death wish today, haven't you? <laughs> we have 15 minutes, but first you're going through the portal. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so wait, are you trying to do this now or are you going through the portal first? I'm probably have too many eggs in my hands to, to like do it now, so I'll do it later on, I guess. Um, I'm gonna have to pretend I didn't hear that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so for the sake right. both of expediency and hopefully this does not end in a bloodbath, you do this after you've exited <laughs> the portal? Sure, yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah. Does a 29 get the loot from you? Um, what's it against? Passive. Your passive, I yeah, presu yeah, presumably passive perception. Oh, yeah, yeah, very easily. Mm. Okay, cool. Mm. Suddenly, the loot's not on your back anymore. I mean, you just hear me playing it. I'm not taking it away forever. I'm just here, like, ding, 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 ding. Mm. I, I wanted to go on it. You said I could have a go on it, so I just wanted to Yeah, why didn't you just ask? I did ask before, and then you didn't let me, so I... I must have missed that, my bad. Yeah, it's good. Boop, 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 boop. It's, good. it's a good feel on it. Yeah, how's it feel? It's really good. All right. <laughs> yeah. uh, can I borrow it for, like, a while, or...? Yeah, of course you can. I mean, I think you Remember what I said. I just wanted to play it. I've done that now. Oh. Ooh, Keep it. We could share it. No, no, no. It'll give us an excuse to see each other more often. <laughs> I've got a whole load of tour material now. <laughs> but wouldn't your tour go better with that massively epic loot? She's playing it horribly, but I couldn't. <laughs> like this, this is like when you're in The Sims and you just learn how to play the guitar. It's that bad. Can you, can you, I've got some. Can you do that? Does that be its fate? It's only a 17. It's not that good. That's all right. That that is the kind of instrument where if you do that to it, it'll it'll um, it'll take its own punishment. So, wow. Um, you really don't want it. I did what I came to do. All right. <laughs> Remember when we were hired to do a job? <laughs> <laughs> oh, the job was a setup. You didn't figure it out when the dragon showed oh, up? Oh, no. I've got one problem, no. though. Uh, yeah. A giant infernal goose would be so damn good on a tour. <laughs> well, it's too late now. No, no, we've we got eggs. We've got Oh, no, no, no. We've also got eggs. We can bring them up and train them rather than have a very angry zombie goose. If I sit on guys, the deck, guys, I, probably, like, I could probably make another think about it. <laughs> okay, I've got two albums now. There we go. Nice. Let All me right. think about this. So, what are you doing with these eggs? Sitting on them. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Singing to them. Yeah. To call your mom. <laughs> They're my brood. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you know what? That's for next time we play. <laughs> uh, That's fair. But you all have, you know, as, the other thing is, as you get through the portal, you feel the grass, you smell the air, and most importantly, you are breathing. Yeah. You are alive. Oh, yeah. Right. And because you have now gone back to slightly before the bronze dragon fricasseed all of you, you are not in the glen. You are not in the, in the cave where you all perished. You are hale and hearty. You now have the knowledge of what's in that cave. So, you know, if you want to, you can just go about your merry way and go shank the dude who set you up. Yeah. You know what, guys? I think if we just talk to the dragon... We can work something out. This isn't the, this isn't Groundhog Day. If you go back there, <laughs> you're on your own. What if we just like call in, like hello? No. Hey. But you hey. know, I'm gonna like physically stop <laughs> away from it now. Come on. No. If you're absolutely gonna insist on taking that dra dragon down, take the side tunnel. 
It saw us coming last time. But you knew about a side tunnel, and why don't you tell us about the side tunnel? Well, I mean, I you all just it. charged ahead. Yeah. How, 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 would I have got my, how would I have got my story? Say <laughs> <Hey>, what? <laughs> He's such an artist. He's so brilliant. you got a lot to learn on this bard business. Well, and I just <laughs> walk away. And with that, you all are restored <laughs> to life. You've defeated the goose. You've got some epic loot. And our story is concluded. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> So I've been your DM, I will go last, but I'm gonna start with Liv. Who are you? What are you doing at the con? What else do you do? <laughs> who are you? What are you doing here? <laughs> yes, why are you here? <laughs> Hi, I'm Liv. I don't know where the camera is. Hi. Um, Liv Kennedy. I am one third of Three Black Halflings, along with Jeremy Cobb and Jasper William Cartwright, who is coming here tomorrow to the con. It's gonna be great. We're gonna be doing a bunch of stuff. Uh, yes, if you wanna follow me on Twitter, I'm at Does Dark Magic over there, and I sometimes I'm on TikTok and I do Twitch sometimes too. Uh, yeah, check out Three Black Things on wherever a pod's a cast. Yeah. yeah. Uh, hello, everybody. I'm another third of Three Black Halflings, like Liv said. Uh, my name is Jeremy Cobb. Uh, you can follow me on Twitter at Jeremy Cobb one That is Cobb with two Bs and the number one. Uh, you can also find me on Twitch uh, if you want more toxic positivity. Uh, <laughs> I stream, I stream uh, several times a week uh, at twitch.tv slash casual quest live because I grew up not really playing very many video games, so I'm very much a casual playing classic games to uh, try and become a true gamer. Um, and like Liv said, you can find Three Black Halflings wherever pods are cast. Ooh. Hello, I'm Samantha Bale. I'm an actor. Um, you very kindly worn the t-shirt from the <laughs> show We've Got It Takes a Village. Yeah. It's archived on YouTube. Do check it out. We interview people from the games industry, people who normally don't have um, any sort of light shone on them. People don't know who they are. Let's find out what they do and how they make video games. Now, I'm doing a lot of stuff here, so I'm going to plug that. Instead, you can find me on Twitter. I like to scream into that void. Um, so we have the evolution of immersive experiences tomorrow um, at 1 o'clock in um, Meeting Academy M2 and M3. Then we have some live podcasts with all three yeah. of the Black Halflings. We tomorrow. probably should have mentioned hey. the panels yeah. we're in. That's good, I'm doing it, I'm doing <laughs> it. It's you, fine, yeah. four o'clock um, in Hall 2, which is here. That's Ooh. good. Oh. And then we have Love, Sex, Agency, and Intimacy in Baldur's Gate 3. Here, do you see we're all friends? Do you get that now? It's all good. And in, in um, M1 at seven o'clock, and then I'm presenting the Irish Video Game Orchestra on Sunday at 1.30 in the Armadillo next door, shortly before the Hugo Awards. So please come down to that. It, we're going to play every piece of music in every video game ever. I've seen the guest list. It, it's insane. But nice. please do come. We're doing things. Very cool. <laughs> and I'm Russell Smith. I, I um, volunteer for various bits and pieces at the con. Um, I'm a student up here. I, um, I write the odd bits and pieces What's for them. I write the odd bits and pieces for RPGs. That's a that's a bar conversation. Okay. <laughs> Fair. Um, and yeah, I've 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 got a I've, I've got a few published stories out uh, out there, so I can talk to you all about this later. But um, you can find me on social media. Just follow the follow the uh, follow the trail of carnage from this um, from from this panel and uh, <laughs> see where it leads you, if you if you wish. <laughs> uh, and I've been your DM. Tanya. Yes. Uh, any time to pass also known as Cypher of Tear Online. I stream on Twitch, I do a lot of other things. My day job is game developer. Uh, I'm on the Three Black Halflings podcast with, with all the halflings and with Sam tomorrow. Also love Sex Agency and Intimacy and Baldur's Gate 3, which we got to do at PAX East earlier this year. It'll be a little spicy. Come with your thoughts about love, sex, intimacy, and agency. Uh, but it's not, gonna be a, it's not gonna be that spicy. We are, you know. But it's me, it's us. It's a mild spice. Yeah, a bit. It's, a, it's a nice dollop of spice. <laughs> um, then Sunday, I'm talking about parasocial relationships, which a lot of people probably should go to. <laughs> uh, uh, that's with Mar Lafferty, uh, John Scalzi, and Gabriel Elvar, who is a PhD student over at the University of Glasgow. Um, and then I will be at the U as an actually presenting at UGO, so I'll be all dolled up and fancy. Yeah. Uh, and then I have two panels on Monday, but they were too long to fit on my bench. So um, <laughs> follow me on the Twitter, and I will be tweeting out when I'm doing things, or Glasgow's uh, accounts are tweeting out. Yep. And yeah, and when I, when I get back home, I'll be streaming and doing other fun stuff. I do TTRPGs and things like that. And thank you for coming on the ride. Heck yeah. Thank Can you. Give a big thank you to Tanya thank for running. Thank you so much. Yeah. 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 Um, 
So thank you also to everyone who is in my Twitch chat. I've been kind of peeping after we killed the goose, and I'm like, well, that goose is going to die. I might as well look at Twitch. <laughs> uh, everyone over on YouTube who's been watching as well, and everyone who is a registered participant in WorldCon, I greatly appreciate it. Thank you so much, all for coming and spending this late Friday night with us. Mm -hmm. uh, and in the great Twitch tradition, I'm going to raid someone on my channel. Uh, <laughs> we're going to pack up and get out of here and go have one last drink at the bar before yeah. you have to be up early tomorrow. <laughs> Thank you. Have a great night. Go do all the fun stuff at the con, and I'll see you all later. Thank you. Now, you have to tell me which of these is yours.